At least now you know. Now you know! Okay. Hope you enjoyed the ducks. Are you well? How's your weekend? What'd you do? Gal just left. Gal just left. He, uh, I think he's lost his wallet. I mean, is anyone surprised? Is anyone surprised? <laughs> do you want to save the game? Yes, save. I don't know where, should, should I save it on? I'll put it there. Saved. Saved. My health and humor are doing good. Piotr, that is, uh, honestly, you can't ask for much more than that, can you? My health and my humor are doing good. Union Jackal, thank you for Prime. 14 months. Losing your wallet is character building. I've never lost my wallet. I've also never lost my phone. Am I like missing out? Is this something that I should be doing in adulthood to like learn something about being an adult? <laughs> Did you even go to London if you didn't lose your wallet? <laughs> You've never lost either of them either. Have I lost my, I've lost, um, I'll tell you what I have lost. Baby. Hokey, we have a tier two stream baby, which means we have twins. Thank you so much for tier two, especially. Thank you, Hokey, so much. How are you? Did you have a good weekend? I tell you what I have lost, guys. I've lost my AirPods and I lost them um, when I was with uh, Castor Bet between London and Paris. Between Twitch, the TwitchCon time and when Castor came to visit me, that I lost a brand new Levi's denim jacket and my AirPods. Maybe she stole them. Maybe she's taken them home. Blame Castor. <laughs> I think I, le I left them on the Eurostar. I think I put it in the above compartment. You know when you put it at the top? And um, oh, I think it's there. I think it was there. Thank you, Reality, for tier two for eight months. Oh my God, baby next year as well. Thank you so much. Choice-based and a musical, I'm here for it. I know, guys, I know I've talked about this. I'm so excited to play this. I uh, just wanna say thank you to Humble Games who have sponsored this stream. Thank you so much for giving me access to this game 10 days early. This game comes out on the 10th of August. Um, it is a world first. This is the first ever branching, role-playing, musical video game. Ever. Ever, ever. And it has a cast that you may recognize from The Last of Us. We have Laura Bailey playing the lead. You've also got Troy Baker in this. You've got Ashley Johnson in this. You've also got Abu uh, Salim, who is one of my friends. I went to drama school with Abu. He plays the lead in um, Assassin's Creed Origins, actually. Um, I've not seen him in so long because we went to drama school together and then we both got busy and so he's in, he's in this as well. The composer is Grammy nominated. You've got Broadway actors in this as well. So people that can really sing. They can't just sing, they can sing. Um, anyway, I've been so excited to see this and the art style is hand drawn and it just looks incredible. Honestly, I'm just so freaking excited. I'm so excited. Bayek, yes, he plays Bayek. Yes, yes, yes. Musical Alexa play. Do you hear the people sing? Do you hear the people sing? Singing the songs. So, okay, you know how I've had my alerts turned off for my Final Fantasy playthrough? I think I will turn them off for this just because it's all about, it's all about the music. It's all about the vibes. So I will have alerts off just for this as well so that we can jam. And when I say jam, I mean cat jam. Please get the jam emotes out. I reckon every single time there's a musical number, we should just spam all of the dancing emojis. Thoughts? Thoughts? One of my favorites is actually Siren's emote, Siren Jam. Oh, Cat Jam's good. Hi, Crate. Hi, Stealthy and the mods. Hello, Peach. Is Darpass here? Yes. Hi, Casabella and Lychee and George and Zen and Beer. <laughs> I hope there are jazz hands. It's based out, uh, based off of Greek mythology. So um, all of the names will be um, kind of Greek gods and things that you would have heard from that era of life. Welcome back. And it's from the lead writer of Dragon Age as well. My God, I mean, there's just so much going on. It's all mixed up in this one big cacophony of joy and euphoria. Lost or taken, Sky T. Oh, are you talking about like um, wallet and phone? I've never had my phone and my wallet lost or taken. Okay, all those chickens. Or I reckon Maggie stole my jacket. I think Maggie stole my jacket and my AirPods. I'm gonna forever think that that's what's happened. Shadow Knight, first of all, seven months. Thank you for seven month three sub. Welcome back again. Srujan, thank you for five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Beezy, thanks for the follow. Choco Rocco, thank you for the follow as well. Welcome to the coop. Thank you, Srujan. Thank you so much. Yes, and it's Greek inspired as well. I know. <laughs> it's starting to sound like some effort was put into the game or something. <laughs> oh. A-list, yeah, so they have an A-list cast, okay, a badass composer. Chicken. 
a talented writer. This has to be a really good game. I'm super excited. And also, something I like about this. Reality! What's happening, guys? Are you drunk? It's a Monday. If you were drunk on the weekend, fine. If you're drunk now, no. It's a Monday. You can't, you're can't. you not allowed to day drink. Thank you so much. I'm not in the game. No, Raz. I wish I was. My god, I wish I was. Thank you, Kevin and Reality for Five Gifted and Srujan before. Thank you so much, Ghost. Do you know that you currently have 100% of the viewers of this game on Twitch? Wait, so there's no one else streaming this live today but me? Does that, is that what you mean, Ghost? Because that's cool. Are you saying Maggie is a magpie? Yes. To be fair, she wouldn't... I, she, the, the, you know what? The, one of the people that would never, ever steal from me, I, be, I reckon, would be Maggie. Ever. 56% of chat has never lost their wallet. Wow, so 44% of you have, have lost your wallet before. I'm so sorry to almost over, almost half of you. Thank you, Surujan. Maybe you're not allowed to say drink, but we can. <laughs> so what if I am drunk on a Monday? <laughs> oh, guys, thank you so much for the level four. I missed you this weekend. Um, Gal came and stayed last night on the couch. We watched Snakes on a Plane last night for the first time. We, we both had never seen Snakes on a Plane, and we watched that last night. Um, it was hilarious. We watched it really late as well, so it was two in the morning, and I'm there watching Snakes on a Plane with Gal. We made popcorn. Samuel L. Jackson was doing Samuel L. Jackson things. It was, um, I can't unsee it, no. So many of those things, I, I have to say my highlight of the film was when one of the snakes got microwaved. Um, and, and, and exploded. I don't know what scientific writing went into that moment where they thought okay if the snake gets microwaved it will blow up um but that happened that definitely happened it was very funny like in gremlins that did that happen in gremlins as well oh my god um rally oh it was 34 percent. right okay got you welcome into the stream by the way love to meet you hello pleon as well i've never lost my phone or wallet and if i did i probably would not live it down at work you don't have to tell anyone if it happens just don't tell anyone that it happened you never have to say it I will never tell anyone. I will have your back, guys. If anyone loses their stuff, I promise you, I'll keep your, I'll keep your secret to the grave. I lost my wallet once. Luckily, someone found it on the street and brought it to me. Oh, that is lucky. That is very lucky. A microwave blew up a gremlin. Oh, they put a gremlin in the microwave. What the hell? I've seen a glazed donut catch on fire in the microwave. Things can definitely explode in them. But a living being, like a snake? I don't know, would that blow up? Cleon, you're so welcome. I'm in the military, so it's kind of hide, hard to hide. Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, if you, I didn't realize you're military. That makes more sense now. <laughs> that makes more sense. Hey, Becky. Hi, Scotty. How do you rate a snake, and, a snake on a plane as an assassination method? That's what was funny about the whole film. Sorry if you don't want spoilers about snakes on a plane, but it has been out for several years now. But the whole point of the snakes on the plane was trying to... They, they were trying to kill a witness for the prosecution like the bad guys so they just put loads of snakes on the plane just to try and take out one person Good to hear Gal made it there with the transit and that rights. person didn't even die so it was useless it just killed loads of random innocent people for no reason <laughs> good to hear Gal made it there with the transit strikes yes he um bless Bruce Bruce picked him up and brought him here and we all we ordered dom dominoes last night and we played crash team racing one of my favorite racing games I forced Bruce to play three cups of that. Um, he won the first game, shockingly. And then I won the last one. Hi, Dark Blood. Hi, St. Clear. Hey, Lyra. He be dance. I didn't lose it, but I found a jacket and AirPods in Paris. Those are mine. I'll tell you something, Darpas. Those are mine, okay? Hi, Gelato and Harry. Felfot, thank you so much for 669 bits again. It's your favorite number. Thank you so much. There's a lot of bits. I appreciate it so much. 69. Oi, oi. Thank you so much. How much face licking was involved? He didn't lick my face today. That was a rich. I'm really glad about that. I lost my wallet in a multi-story car park in Liverpool. Someone found, someone found it, contacted my hairdresser on the business card in my wallet and returned it to my address on my driving license. That is like, I don't, that's like some kind of crime drama. That's incredible. I have an actor friend yes. who fell through the floor in a play recently. With all the events that happened to him, I think it was just a stage he was going through. The, the dad jokes have started. 
the dad jokes have begun. Uh, Kuri has started them off. I have an actor friend who fell through the floor in a play recently. With all the events that happened to him, I think it was just a stage he was going through. They've begun. Kuri has kicked them off. <laughs> the week has begun. Chaos emoji. It's not true what they say about Liverpool. I was actually brought up uh, in Chester rally. That's where I'm from originally before I moved to London. So Liverpool was very near to me. I've been to Liverpool several times, a lot, a lot of times. Um, good morning, Dallas. Hello, Blue Train. You probably forgot the right jacket in a restaurant or something. It was definitely on the Eurostar. It was such it was such hot weather at TwitchCon that I brought a jacket, not realizing that I would never need to wear it because it was so warm. So I, I put the jacket on, on the kind of the the holding bit you know the holding bit and i just never picked it up again i think gal are you watching on your way home on the, are you on the train i love you oh my god another sorry another thing me and gal binged watched the first five or four episodes of the 100 it's this show set in korea where there's a hundred super strong men and women and they all like have to like it's a, it's a battle to win a lot of money and they have to just be the strongest. It's such a good show. We were obsessed. Especially like the fighting. We were like, go on. Get him. One versus 100. There we go. That's it. Man, man versus machine. That's the one. It was so good. We just finished that show. Physical 100. Yes. Oh my God. It's so good. The 100 is a different thing. No, the 100 is a, is a actual TV show with like a script. This is a reality I show. I was born with a photographic memory. I believe I was born. I just never developed it. I believe I was born with a photographic memory. I just never developed it. Seek help, chat. Seek help, please. <laughs> Fortnite? Are we talking about Fortnite? Get that word out of this stream, Strujan. Get that word out of this stream. I met a nice girl at a concert last night I met and a nice girl at a concert last night and home. asked her to call me when she made she it home. She must be homeless. She must be homeless. I met a nice girl at a concert last night and asked her to call me when she made it home. She must be... <laughs> However you want to sleep at night, cruise control. Maybe she just had no home. You're absolutely right. By the producer of Snakes on a Plane, here comes Jacket and an AirPod on a train in theatre soon. How did the ancient Greeks measure their football fields? How did the ancient Greeks measure their football fields by Demeter? Oh my god. To be fair, it's the one thing about my name that gives away that I'm Greek. Obviously not my skin tone. Um, but my name, the, the Demi in my name, sometimes people go, oh, you're What's Greek? The difference I'm like, thank God. Thank God. Kmar, thank you for the follow. Uh, Morality Core and Matty as well, thank you. Welcome in, it's nice to have you. Nice to have you here. What's the difference between a violin and a viola? The viola burns longer? Wait, that's gone over my head. That's a whoosh moment. Help me. Wait, no, I'm going to try and get it. I'm going to try and get it. What's the difference between a violin and a viola? Voila, voila. The viola burns long. When I was young, I wanted to play the guitar really badly. After years of hard work, perseverance, and practice, I Help can me. play the guitar really badly. You're overthinking it. I don't understand. The viola is slightly bigger. Yeah, so it just burns longer because it's got more. There's just more wood. That's it. That's the joke. That joke was a violation. <laughs> Thank you, Miz. You don't get it either. Okay, good. I feel better. I feel better about this. Archer, welcome in. Hello, Dills. D7. Yes, my cat is here. Do you want to say hi to the stream before we play? I'm also really... You know what I'm also excited about, guys? You, um... This is what, because it's one of those decision-based games that the, the soundtrack that you will get, all the songs that you will hear in the game will be completely like unique to your playthrough. So there'll be some songs that you won't hear or some songs that you will hear depending on what you choose. So everything's gonna be unique. Everything that like I experience will be different to what you experience. So I'm really excited. I'm really excited. And also just letting you know, if you're excited about it, it's available on the 10th on Steam, Xbox, PlayStation and Switch. It's on the Switch as well, which is cool because when things are on the Switch, it means you can take it with you. It's a portable game. You can be on the train. 
still enjoying the vibes. Okay, would you like to say hi to everybody? You want to come here? Why do seagulls fly over the ocean? They're releasing Because four different soundtrack albums. Over the bay, we call them I wonder if it's going to be on Spotify. Hello, Ak. And have I, have I said hello to Scotty? Scotty, did I say hi? Hello, Jacob. Kowalian. Any copyright issues? That's a good point. I wonder. It might mute the... Oh. It might mute the VOD, but it might not. I don't know. Hopefully not. Hi, not Foxy. Welcome. Ugh. Living in the Northeast US, it's always been weird how low key the Greek community seems compared to other. How low key? How do you mean low key, man? Um, how do you mean low key? I'm trying to understand. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? I love the capital letters. The enthusiasm is real. There are too many games I must have coming out. I know, it's a good year for games at the moment. Last year I felt like it was really slow and I was like, okay, nothing's happening. And then this year it's just gone boom, all at once. I can't wait for this game. Laura Bailey has the voice of an angel. Isn't it funny how a lot of actors can sing? I feel like a lot of actors can either sing or dance as well. Or some, I mean, some can do all three, but I feel like a lot of actors can do a bit of everything. Please, please sit down. Are you done? Yeah? Happy? How have you got early access? Are you in the game? No, I'm not in the game. They're just uh, today sponsored by Humble Games. They've sponsored the stream, so I get to show it to you 10 days early. I'm super excited. I'm very lucky as well. Ooh. And also, thank you to you guys, because I obviously would never get an opportunity to play something early access if it was not for you watching me in the first place. So thank you for having these opportunities, giving me these opportunities. Hi, Sarcasm Caffeine. Sarcasm Caffeine, that is such a good name. Yeah, Bold is, oh my God, Bold is Gate 3 and Starfield's, Starfield is right before Christmas. I thought it was after Christmas for some reason. I don't know why. Starfield's, yeah. Okay, do you wanna sit down? Please sit down. Please sit down. I can dance, didn't get so lucky with the vocal cords, but I can body pop. Archer is breaking it down. I cannot dance. If some, I've told you before, if someone comes up to me and goes, right, Anna, five, six, seven, eight, I will leave the room and I will never come back. You will never see me again. <laughs> you will never see me again. Starfield is uh, September 6th, right, okay. When two vegans get into an, argument, get in an argument, is it still is called it still beef? Be? No, I get, maybe it's called tofu. Oh my gosh. Me and this guy, we were right in the tofu. We're having some bare tofu. Jazz hands time. Okay, please sit down. Anna, pede, oh. exi, epta, octo. Let's go. Oh no, five, six, seven, eight. Spazzy wants me to leave the room and never come back. Lucky for you, Spazzy. Technically, I'm at work, so I'm not leaving. But if this was in a different situation, I would leave the room and never come back. <laughs> nice, Archer. Okay, do it. Hello, Grumpy A. Hi, Mikis. Okay, have I said hello to everybody? Okay, you are really, I love you, but you're really annoying me now. I ordered a chicken and an egg from Amazon. Sit I down. I let you know. Sit down. Oh. Are you finished? Are you finished? Oh, there we go. She's settled. Did you know that Vin Diesel only eats two meals a day to stay in shape for making movies? Breakfast and break furious. Breakfast and break furious. Is that, is that what that said? Pass fast peach. Thank you for the five dollar donation. Did you say break? Did you say break furious? I know, Skyty. That was bad, wasn't it? That was very bad. Boo. For a second, I was like, "Oh, this is an interesting fact about Vin Diesel." And then I was like, "Oh, oh, oh, wait, no, no, it's not. Of course, it's not." That's the worst joke ever. Oh no. Whoever said that joke, whoever donated that, um, you're getting roasted. You're getting roasted. <laughs> Hi, Slay Demons. Looking forward to seeing this for about 15 minutes. Okay, yes, I don't need to get spoilers, of course, I understand. But um, what's nice is, like I said before, is that every, every playthrough will be different. So thankfully, your playthrough of this game will look very different to mine. Let me get it, let me get the game up. Let's go. Are you, are you gonna behave? Because we need to focus on this, all right? All right? I might need to go uh, get my controller wire so that we don't, just to charge it. 
Oh my god. I love that auto mod has kept that. Um, that made me laugh, Scotty. Finally, Bun has shown the stream her... Well, let's just say bum hole, shall we? And she's happy enough to sit. Yes, exactly. Hi, ISG. How are you doing? Very cute cat. She is cute. She's a rescue cat. Uh, therefore, is like very... Just kind of hates the world a bit, you know? But for some reason, loves me. Hates everyone but me. Um, I don't really know how. But I'm lucky. I'm lucky. She was slapping Gal yesterday. She swiped him. She full on swiped his swiped his hand. Didn't you? He didn't draw blood, but that would be shocking. It'd be shocking otherwise. Okay, let me go get my controller wire. <laughs> I'll moderate myself in the future. No, Scotty, let yourself be free. Let yourself be free. Um, I'm gonna try and pronounce your name. Is it wrong? Do I say? Is it Zyxel? My first time watching you. Andrew, Welcome in. Zyxel. Hi, Honey Yellow. And Dubby Dubs. And Unusual Player. And everybody. Have I missed anybody? Puffles? Pete? Commandant Herd? Jonathan Damon? Canar Mechanics? Thank you for hanging out with me on this on this very fine Monday. I'm going to go get my controller wire, which means I'm going to have to move her. She's going to hate me. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so excited, though. She clearly was showing Gal who the mod in Anna's house is. That's so true. Maybe she was like, I moderate this house. Because Gal is my mod. She was like, I'm the mod in this place. Oh, I just accidentally punched her in the face. I'm sorry. Do I see cat's protection in the chat? Look at you. You okay? Welcome back. You're so regal. Oh wow, she looks very, very regal. Very kind of princessy. She's purring. RSPCA on the way, no. Did I see Cat's Protection? There you are, there you go, hello. Um, did you get my message, Cat's Protection, on Twitter? Me, me and Cat's Protection met at uh, TwitchCon. We were conspiring together about some kind of content ideas. The regal look off into the distance, I know. Okay. Okay! I told you. I told you. Clip it. Clip it. Clip it. What's funny is that I get the hisses, but she will never hit me. But everybody else, she'll hit them. <laughs> she loved you, she said. Yeah, that's her showing me love. Because if it wasn't love, she would have slapped me in the face. I'm saying. Such aggressive love. <laughs> Let me get my uh, wire. Hold on. She hates the mic. I'm just glad, I, I used to have a noise gate on the microphone, which meant that you couldn't hear when she made those noises, but now I've taken it off, so you can hear everything. Every time she does that now, you will hear it. You will hear it. Okay, controller, in. Uh, pillow. Pillow around the middle. Hi madness, the mic is now bun friendly, exactly. You're a cat whisperer, clearly. <laughs> it took her a long time to love me. And even now, do you know what I mean? This is what, four years later? There's still so much animosity. But still so much love. Hello, P. How are you doing? Hi, MCR and Jesh. Okay, let me turn my let me turn my alerts off just so that we can hear all of the the songs and all of the dialogue. Okay, I'm excited. I'm excited, I'm excited, I'm excited. I believe that you can pick your personality at the beginning. Ooh! Okay, I hope that the volume is right. I wanted to make sure that it wasn't too loud, but not too, I put it on 70. Hopefully that's okay for stream. If it's too quiet or too loud, we can change it. 
I wish Ginger and Bun could meet each other. You know that we that we have me and Maggie on FaceTime a couple days ago put our cats on the FaceTime, so they've technically met each other. They've just met on FaceTime. Does, does that count? Maybe? Evil? I don't think there's an evil personality. Okay, new game. New game slot. From our team all across the world, enjoy the show. This game was made on stolen ground. We would like to acknowledge the... Okay, I'm not gonna... I don't want to do the, the disinjustice. That's not even a word, but the... Uh, <laughs> disinjustice, I've made it up. The, I'm not pronouncing those. Peoples of the Kulin Nation. Uh, so sovereignty was never ceded. This game was also built on Treaty 6 territory and a traditional meeting ground and home for many indigenous peoples, including Cree. Um, oh my God, this is amazing. I didn't know this part, actually. I didn't know this part. Content warnings. Okay, there you go, guys. If any, if anyone's triggered by any of these things, good for you to know. Do you think, I'm trying to think, Raj, should we have like a pinned, <laughs> say it, D7, try and pronounce it. I don't want to butcher wonderful words. Um, we sh Maybe, it should be okay, maybe Raj. I was just thinking about whether we have a trigger warning pinned at the top or not, but maybe it's okay. We can, I guess people can, um, we can tell people as and when they come in maybe. Hi, Ember. Hi, Mira. Hi, Butters. No, I'm not, Flacia. I'm not in this. No. I wish. I wish. I think it's good. Okay, okay. Begin game. Are you ready? Good. I love the art style so much. Four hours. Four hours in a rented gym that still smells like socks and childhood trauma. And where did it get us? Other than bored? The band wasn't <laughs> even looking for anything specific. Childhood trauma. We just I relate. Hashtag relate. We wanted to see who was out there. If they'd show up. Well, they showed up all right. You know, I had a dream where this exact thing happened. Except we were on stage. And naked. We were auditioning. Not all of us. Okay, it was just me. I was naked. I think this went better. Wow. Yes, she is. Yes, Rujan, yes. Oh, shit! Is it timed? Okay, no, it's not timed. Okay, what do I say? I, d I guess my, my, my response could seem flirty if she's saying that now, so I need to be careful what I'm saying here. What signals I'm sending off. I'm going to say you're trying to make me feel better. I see what you're doing, Freddy. You're just trying to make me feel better. How about making us feel better? We sat through this too. I'm so sorry you all had such a rough time. Freddy has a bad idea. What else is new? Okay, let's just wrap this up. Kaz, do you need a ride? Just to Brian's. I'm uh, crashing on his couch until I get a new place. That armpit what? fluff, though. You said it'd be two days. You know Flirt, you like having me around. <laughs> Whatever. Have you heard yourself snore? I don't snore, thankfully. Just saying. Free hey, information Grace, for you. Okay? I know you've been kind of loose ends since you left college. I was just hoping tonight would cheer you up. <laughs> oh, oh my god. So is, does the heart mean flirting? I'm okay. It's frustrating. I know you meant well. I guess we won't know until we try. Let me try that option and see if it seems flirty or not. Brian's a pick me for sure. I don't snore, says everyone who snores. I genuinely don't snore. I'm a silent sleeper, you will never know. If I'm asleep next to you, I'm like a silent baby. Baby. Um, Augustine, thank you for the three months. I'm really sorry, are you still here? I missed it seven minutes ago because I'm an idiot. Thank you for the resub. Oh. What did you say? You want, should I make my camera smaller so you can see more things? Is that what you want? Am I am I in the way a bit? Should I go here? I'll just spend the whole game like this. Hiding. No one has had the heart to tell you yet. Wow. Mad Doc, thank you for 16 months. Um, I haven't been here a while, but apparently sub kept going. <laughs> Mad Doc, I'm sorry if you didn't mean to cancel it. <laughs> Welcome back, though. Thank you so much for such a long time. Romancing everyone, Caster would hate this game already. Okay, I'm gonna attempt. Okay, let's just see if this is flirty or not. I don't know what's gonna happen. You're always looking out for me, Freddy. 
<sighs> well, that's okay. the deal, right? Best friends to the end. Friendship. <clears throat> Friendship. Right. I just wish it wasn't always so one-sided. What? Hey, <laughs> hey, don't don't worry about that, really, Grace. You'll get through this. Oh, I panicked. Music is your life, Freddy. You're the drummer, the lyricist. All, all of this was your idea. I just... I wish I knew where I fit. I think you fit. You know that, right? Oh. Yeah. I love her outfit. The green jacket with the green hat. Friends owned already, start again. <laughs> I'm gonna hang out a bit and lock up. <laughs> I'll see you at home. Oh my god, the leather jacket, the dark hair. I'm going to turn the volume up a bit, actually. I think I want to hear it a bit more. Like a boat lost at sea. That's really her voice? With no sails, not a breeze. I am drifting cold waters, no star to be seen. Chills. Are you gonna take the mic or are you just gonna stay in the audience? Is the world too much or is it just me? Everything I set upon unravels at my feet. She's so good. Everything I've learned wasted on a girl who doesn't know how to be free. Like a boat lost at sea. We're being interrupted. With no sails. Not a breeze. I am drifting cold waters. No star to be seen. Oh, uh. <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> I, I didn't mean to interrupt. I just. Ellie! I heard you from outside. It's Ellie. My name's Calliope. Oh my god. You. You have an amazing voice. Oh! I hope you know that. Uh, thanks. I'm, I'm Grace. Are you here for the audition, or...? Go on. We've heard you sing. We know you um, can. Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. That fur jacket, though. Let's go. Oh. Everyone else is gone. Let's hear it. Yeah, let's hear it. I'm just gonna go, let's hear it right now. Okay. Did you uh, bring an instrument or some music? I kind of bring my music wherever I go. Harmonica. <laughs> All right, well. Beatboxing? <laughs> With the fire furious, I have burned my tongue. I'm so happy right now. From all the promises to many dreams unsung. All the steps I didn't take and paths proved untrue. Is there any path through? It's like Abby and Ellie like singing to each other. Lost at sea. Oh, I'm about to oh, You still have your life ahead. I am drifting cold waters. No star to be seen. All things that lose their way can find it again. There is no inertia. Oh my god. In the middle of the song, in the middle of the song, it wants me to choose my personality. I'm gonna cry. Honestly, I feel myself. Yeah, I honestly, them, their voices together, it's weird, especially I think because I'm such a fan of The Last of Us as well. I'm so familiar with their voices that hearing them 
kind of coming together in a very different setting and singing together and it's like I feel such a mixture of things at the same time it's such a mix um Space Wolf thank you for 23 months I'm doing really well I'm doing I'm having such a nice day so far especially because of this welcome in how are you today thank you for the resub charming kick-ass or clever I think I'm I'm, I'm leaning towards kick-ass or charming charming is like my my gut my gut instinct this is Grace with soul and charisma. She tries to do the right thing and everyone likes her more for it. I feel like, I'm not saying that I'm charming, but I'm saying I definitely try and do the right thing, if I can, rather than being reckless and aggressive when it's called for. I think I'm probably more of a, what's clever? Sneakier, smarter, and witty. Guys, my gut's going charming. Riz, Riz. Hi, Steel Bro, just found out about, oh, sorry, I missed what you said. Just found out about this game today and I'm so excited already. Oh my god, we've had one, we've we've had like two thirds of a musical number, Steel Bro, and I'm already in love. Yes, Valentin, it became like a duet and the songs completely, they just like merged together. It's so beautiful. Go with your gut. Okay, charming is what my gut's saying. Let's go charming. What's she gonna say? Maybe if I leaned upon my friends, raise the alarm, I'll call for them. Do I have the heart to trust they'll keep me safe from harm? Does that symbol at the top <gasps> left mean saving? I guess it's a save. What was that? Your song was just so wonderful. I had to finish it with you. I hope that's all right. I also know what it feels like to be lost. To feel as if you have no place to turn. That's why I had to come inside. Oh my God. Oh my God. Can I ask what's wrong? I'm glad you did. Have we met before? You aren't here to audition. I'm gonna say if we met before because it feels like they know each other, they feel familiar. Cancerian, charming, hand in hand. Thank you, Archer. What can I say? <laughs> what would Bun do? I know, Butter. Oh, nice to see you, Butter. The cast is insane in this. I assume if you choose a different trait. Yeah, I was just thinking, maybe she sings a different line of the song if you pick a different personality trait. Tough choice when you're all of those things. J Fast saying all the right things to me today. I'm gonna say, have we met before? It's really weird. I feel like, have we met before? I don't think so, but artists often find me familiar. What does that mean? It means I've traveled in many circles. Past lives? May I ask you why you feel so adrift? You're so young. Surely your life is just beginning. Are they not the same age? Be guarded, be honest, joke about it. Oh, God. Oh, what would I do? What would I do? What would I do? What would I do? I probably would. I mean, if I just met somebody, I probably would joke. But I want to be honest in the game, in the sense of the game. Hi, Ivan. Um. Yeah, you met in Seattle. Squishy face, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Squishy face. Hello, Iron Man. I know, I feel emotion. And I don't even know much about what's happening. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be honest, I think, actually. I know it sounds stupid. No, say Please. it. Try me. Well... I left school because I didn't feel like I belonged there, but I still haven't found my place. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Where am I supposed to go? Shouldn't I have figured this out by now? Those are good questions to ask. Oh, she's smart. She's wisdomous. I should go. No! What? No answers? Uh, about the audition. I'm sure everyone will agree you're in, if, if you want to be, that is. I hope to see you again, Grace. <laughs> 
Perhaps soon. So she wasn't there to audition. Maybe she's in our imagination right. or something. See you then. I want her to be real so badly. Hope she's real. Oh my god. What an opening. That's it! I want her to come back. Oh wow, we need to we need to tidy this house a little bit. We got to tidy. We got to tidy it up. <laughs> I know. I know. Hi, Sasha. Okay, she's in a good mood. She's got a beer. Living it up. Hello? <laughs> Did you lose your keys, Fred? I thought you'd be... Calliope? What? I didn't know her else... Oh, I'm so sorry, Grace. Okay, she's definitely real. What happened? What, what happened? Who did this? It, it doesn't matter now. I didn't want to do this to you. I, not like this. I'm so, so sorry. What do you mean? Hey. Calliope! Stop. That's her please. only. That's her role finished. On. Blood. Oh, oh, oh. Magic. Her soul is leave leaving her body. What? Joint, is it gonna go in me? What is that? Oh no, we're possessed. In a good way? Happy possessed. Is she really dead? Oh, um, I can wait. Take your time. What? I... Who... Is that my door? Technically, it's my door. Or... Our door, maybe? I, um, I came as soon as I could. Can I turn the volume up right now? Because I want it a bit louder, I think. Master volume. I'm going to put it on... 82. Don't know why, it just feels right. Oh! Wait, I didn't save it, did I? Classic. If I do it with the mouse, then I can switch. 82. I don't know why, it just feels right. Confirm. There we go. Back. Um, I don't think that person did that to, to her. I'm going to ask who she is. OCD is going crazy right now. I'm just trying to piss you guys off. I'm just trying to piss you guys off. <laughs> You're like, 82? Stop! It would have been worse if it was 83. Come on. It would have been worse. Uh, hold on. Who are you? How did you get here? Through the door? I mean, geez, how did you get here? Why is my door glowing? <sighs> she really is dead, huh? Man. Hermes. So, the course is gonna want to talk to you. Sucks, but, you know. Okay, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the badass option. Okay, okay, is it saying that I can't do that option? It's grayed out. Is that because I didn't choose that character selection? So I can't click that. No, I can't. Okay, so if I'd picked kick ass, I could have said, explain this right now. But because I didn't, I'm just gonna have to go. What is happening? <laughs> I, I don't understand. Riz is not None gonna help me here. None of this makes any sense. She's dead, and I, I, I don't. Look, I can see you don't know squat about this, so I'm gonna explain real quick, but then you gotta come with me, okay? When Cal died, you saw a shiny thing come out of her, right? Yep. That was her soul. That's what made her a god. She's a god? A what? It's in you now, which makes you a god. Surprise, right? You with me so far? Cool. Let's go. Flashbang. Ooh, 
Facts. Hey, Crate. <sighs> Uh, Welcome where back. are we? Sorry to drop you and run, but when an idol dies, there's like a hundred different things I gotta do. When an idol dies... No, 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 wait. Where did you bring me? How did we get here? The chorus can explain. Don't touch anything. Okay? I'm gonna touch everything. Wait! Pick up everything! <gasps> Unless you explain, I'm gonna okay. pick everything up. Yeah. Okay. I'll just wait here. And, oh, no. Uh, oh, there's an owl. Touch anything. Not touching anything. I'm gonna touch everything. Okay, we're looking at the paintings. I see Booba sitting on the desk. <gasps> cookies? No one said there was cookies. Oh, but I'm not allowed to touch them. I can't touch the cookies, so I can't have one. Because that counts as touching. Just one, maybe just one little. No, what? No, they're yours. I get it. I get it. It's your thing. That's fine. Okay. Everyone is so cool. I feel so uncool. All the hair, the cape, the Our neck piece. Beloved sister, the last of the muses has passed on to you, our new sister, delivered to us by dear sweet Hermes. It's, uh, Grace, yes? Yes. Um, yes? Oh, my, my. You have had quite the day, haven't you? I'm gonna say Calliope's really dead. So Calliope is really dead. Even if she's a... A god? Yeah, a, a god. Mm. Yes, we call it passing on, but yes, sadly, it happens even to us. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Athena, goddess of wisdom. Hi, Athena. This is Apollo, god of prophecy. Hello. Dressed for the occasion, as always. Nice abs. The wondrous Aphrodite, goddess of love. Looking fresh. And the one glaring at you is Persephone, once queen of the underworld. Oh. Together, we are the Chorus. We rule over the idols, our name for the gods who remain. All of us, hidden in your modern world. <laughs> so Greek gods be looking fine. <laughs> no capes. 1D, thank you for 75 bits. Hey, Rish, I'm not in the game. No, sorry. I feel like I should preface that, maybe. I'm absolutely not in the game, but we the stream is sponsored by Humble Games today. We get to play it 10 days early, and I'm super excited. I wish I was in it, of course. Um... BG's at very own Barry Dib. Everybody is gorgeous. Everybody is gorgeous here. Um, okay. Question mark symbol I'm guessing just means like it will take the conversation to a specific direction. Gods are real and you live here. You expect me to believe this. I'm more intrigued as to whether the, where we are. I think I'm going to ask about where, where we are right now. You live where? Like where are we? Right. And you live here. Not in some city in Europe or a on top of a mountain. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. Mount Olympus? Once we roamed marble halls, and now, fashionably appointed apartments. We have Wi-Fi. <laughs> oh, good. What's the code? We move with the times, Grace. No. We have to, if we're going to remain hidden and survive. The mortals grow more and more clever with each passing century. Television! <laughs> I do what I must. I feel like she's being very nice, but I also feel like she would kick ass if she needs to, you know? Jethro, thanks for the follow. Persephone with the daddy vibes. Mommy? I just wish I was Greek. Hi, Strictly. That would be on brand for Athena, yeah. She's like, I mean, she feels like very secure and direct and powerful, but she feels like if she needs to take someone out, then she would. Um. I'm going to ask all the questions. Maybe it will help. Okay, uh, gods are real? But gods aren't real. They can't be. They're just... Stories, myths, legends. If you're real, you'd be all-powerful. You wouldn't be hiding or... Mm. Don't pay much attention to those old tales about us, Grace. 
they weren't very true to begin with, and... Rumors. Well, truth be told, we've diminished since those days. That doesn't mean we're helpless, of course. Far from it. Yet, at the end of the day, we two are just people. Trying to get by. Interesting. You expect me to believe this? No, I don't I don't feel like I, I kind of just want to take what she's saying as face value. I don't feel like I need to question her. I'm like, okay. I'm not gonna quiz her further. I accept what's happening. Wait, you said and Hermes said that I'm a god now too. And an idol. That is true. American idol. That, Sorry. I mean they're singing. The thing that came out of her that went into me. We call it an Eidolon, the part of Calliope's soul which made her an idol, which now makes you one. Athena, we are wasting time. The reason you're here, Grace, <laughs> the reason why we made you wait so long while we debated, is because we have rules. Those Cypriot rules idol. mean we can't admit into our ranks a usurper, <laughs> never mind a possible murderer. I know this will all come as a shock, and I'm so, so sorry to say it, but I'm afraid you have to die. Excuse me? Say what? She said possible murderer, so they think that I might have killed her at this point because they can't prove otherwise. Athena, goddess of war, with cookies as throwing stars. I think the cookies are exclusively for the owl. The owl seemed very territorial over those cookies. Hi, Gus. Welcome in. Nice to meet you. This took a turn, I know. I, I mean, she just now wants to kill us. I've got a charisma option, so I might use it. But I don't want to be rude, because it says that isn't fair. Like, I, if someone says we're going to kill you now, I don't want to be like, not fair! Because then it could speed up that process slightly. But I'm, I want to see what the charisma does. You want me to die? But, but that isn't fair. I know, I know. But consider it from our point of view. A dear sister. Someone who traveled with us through the ages. Gone. Yeah, but it wasn't me. But I didn't do it. Aren't you supposed to be the goddess of wisdom? Can't you see this isn't right? Calliope's blood is literally on your hands. Because she fell on me. Physically. This is not my fault. Oh, she looks so helpless. Maybe we, we should- We should do as we agreed. Calliope's line would end, yes, but what other option do we have? Let a usurper remain an idol? Justice has to be done, for Calliope's sake. But... This isn't justice! Oh, 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 oh. Musical number, let's go! It could be anyone's blood, exactly. DNA test, where is that? from this reality I'm not hiding though a little lost she's gonna sing a song about how I need to die little girl little girl who you this bears explanation please dear child please listen I'm listening you have usurped a muse No recourse to be arranged, but it's unfair. I know, but our laws cannot be changed. But she came to me. You must realize there are simple rules. If one of us dies, these rules have been the tools that she. You must know. Us. I didn't do it. Is it weird this isn't song? No. <laughs> The muse is gone. I love how self aware it is. I'm afraid you'll have to see. Troy? Oh, he disagrees? He wants to save my life? Did I hear that correctly? You've been quiet this entire time, Apollo. Why speak up now? 
I grieve Calliope's loss just as much as the rest of you, but I, I can't let you do this. That's Troy, isn't He's it? He's right. What if Grace speaks the truth? What if Calliope chose her? Uh, and what if Calliope was murdered by her? What if Grace stole her idol? Can someone just look into the past and see what actually out. happened, please? Don't you want justice? Has no one got a crystal ball or something? Oh, Apollo, I thought we'd agreed this was justice. What would you have us do? Not kill me. Um, let me prove myself. We need to find the truth. I want a trial. Oh, all of them are good options. All of them are good. I mean, I would like to find out who really did kill her. So we need to find the truth is helpful. But let me prove myself feels like cool. Zaddy Apollo. Is his shirt too small to button it up? <laughs> Great. Um, let me prove, I, I, oh God. I want to say we need to find the truth because I want to actually find out what happens. I didn't do it. <laughs> that should be the option. I didn't do it. There has to be some way to find the truth. Aren't you gods? Couldn't a god, I don't know, We aren't seriously considering this. Considering what? We're going back in time? Oh, very well. This one time. I put a motion before the chorus. Do we allow Grace the right to prove her innocence? Yes. Yes. Two. I think so. Yes. That's three. <sighs> Five. That's a four. And there we have it. Five. You're going to Hollywood. Okay, um, I'm gonna say, so I live. So no dying, am I hearing that right? No grace getting smited by the gods? You say Calliope chose you. I would like to believe that. I truly would. You have one week to find out what happened, Grace. One week? What happens after a week? I die. There will be a trial. If you cannot provide proof of your innocence by then, oh. Our original verdict stands. Okay, we've got to find clues, guys. We have to find clues. Hades just hates his job. Rated, thanks for the follow, welcome in. I like how they were so eager to kill you without a second thought. They were just ready. Well, to be fair, I guess if they're like very important people and then one of them, and then a random human being has just got blood of one of them on their hands, you would be like, bye. So we've got to find who actually did kill her. How do I find the killer? Will do. Will do. Or this, I'm going to ask how, what, what, where do they, what do they suggest? Can someone explain to me just how I'm supposed to find the truth? I'm not a detective. I don't know anything about the idols. Well, that's for you to figure out. I knew you were going to say that. How did I know you were going to say that? We're not going to keep you, Grace. You have much to do. Before you go, however, a few rules. Mm -hmm. Do not reveal our existence to the mortal world. This okay. includes mortal authorities. They no cannot help you. Don't tell the police. Don't Do tell. not harm another idol. Do not leave the city. Okay. Do as the chorus commands. Can someone write this down? Otherwise, do whatever you must to find the true killer. If they exist. Okay. Oh, that's all? <laughs> Welcome, dear sister. Oh, that's all? And do Thanks, help Kevin. Yourself to Thank you, drunk. Cookie. Lyra, thank you. Oh, I get to have a cookie now? What's in the cookie? The owl is like, over my dead body, you eat my cookies. Day one, time to head home. So this is my journal. Can I read? Time to, what am I doing? Do I not get to, I just press X and I'm there. Oh, journal. Okay, so I can read my, so I can document my thoughts in the journal with what's going on. Hey, Luxy, Luxy, <laughs> welcome in. Am I, am I butchering your name? I swear I'm getting worse with reading names out and most of the time. Hi, Scoom as well. Um, I don't know much about this Apollo. He's the only guy on the chorus, but he didn't say much of anything until he kind of defended me, I guess. 
Also, Crate, to answer your question, his shirt looks absolutely large enough to button up. I think he's just probably actively choosing not to button it up. I think. I'm guessing. She's called Freddy. I only call her Farishta when I'm visiting her house. Her mum always makes these deep fried honey snacks I love. Okay, so she's been her best friend since probably forever. We used to make up rhymes while we skipped rope. It's been that long. We've come a long way from those days. Okay, so the band is called Edge of Elysium. And inviting me in was her idea. I can sing, sure. And when we get a gig, it feels good being up there on stage. But is this really my thing? I don't know. Okay. Gosh, I, I can't believe Ashley Johnson dies so quickly in the game. I can't believe it. If my torso looked like that, I wouldn't even put the shirt on. <laughs> Just off 24-7. Hi, Twizzler as well. Okay, I know uh, Calliope was one of the muses, but that's really about it. I don't know where she lived, what she got up to, or who her enemies were. I have so many questions. For one, what was she doing when she found me at the gymnasium? Was she just passing by or did she plan that? That's true. She just walked in, sang with me and left. And it didn't seem like an audition because she didn't seem to care about being in the band. I kept thinking about what Calliope said to me before she died. She seemed so sad. Did she know this was going to happen? Most of all, why did she pick me? That's true. Maybe she came in, parted some wisdom, knew she was going to die, peaced out. And maybe she knew, she was like, that's the person I'm going to give my godness to. <laughs> He's just stood there like... Maybe there'll be flashbacks. That's true, Spazzy. Yeah. Maybe there'll be moments where we get to... Cause, especially because her soul is now in us. Maybe we will think back and see some stuff that's happened. Hermes is... Hermes is um, historically the messenger, correct? So that's why... Uh, they brought me... Okay. Correct? Messenger? Hi, Heimdall. Hi, Pike. No, this is early access. This stream is sponsored today. We're getting to play it 10 days early. I'm super excited. I'm super excited. It comes out on August 10th on PlayStation, Switch, Xbox, and Steam. You can wishlist it now if you want to. It's available. It's ready to be wishlisted. Wishted. Wishted is a cross between wish and listed. Wishted. Okay, sorry, go back. And then if I, time to head home. I'm just wondering, I'm just pressing up and down and it just keeps going up and down there. Do I just press back? Oh, Grace's apartment. Yes, go. Yes, okay, there we go, we got it. Hermes is the messenger, Apollo is the god of sun and healing. Okay. Hello, fish. Hi, reality. How do you mean kickback? Grace? The body's gone. Grace! No blood, nothing. Uh, hi. Hi! 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 You're kidding, right? When I came home, the door was wide open. You weren't answering your phone. Kaz and Brian are still out looking for- Grace! We thought something happened to you. Wait, did something happen to you? Well, not- Okay, no, the rule, they gave me rules and they said to not tell anybody. She's my best friend. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Loot, thanks for the follow. Welcome, baby. Break the rules. Well, I, I die. You didn't find a body? We're not going to talk about that. Make up a story? Oh, God. Oh, my God. They lit okay, they said, don't tell the mortal world about us. Don't leave the city. Don't... Did you write it down? I told you to write it down. Did you write it down? What happened? What happened? It was like, no cops. Okay, no cops. I think I might make up a story. Is that bad? Um, Dedank Magician, thank you for the 11 month resub. Thank you so freaking much. Didn't they say, don't tell mortal authorities? Well, she said, she said not to, that the mortal world can't know that they exist. So if I say I became a god, that's me telling the mortal world about them. I wrote it down, not telling you though. <laughs> Snitches get stitches. Okay, I'm gonna, 
If I say you didn't find a body, I can tell her that there was a dead body in the apartment without it, without telling her that it was a god. You know, we can make, I can have my best friend help me with the murder inquiry without telling her that, that it was an immortal being. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. When you got home, there wasn't a body here? No blood or anything? A body? What do you mean? Like a dead body? No? Yeah. What? A woman named Calliope. She, she showed up. Don't say, was... don't say god thing. <laughs> you were gone all night. Why didn't you answer your phone? Is she just gonna ignore that? Well, I was calling and calling. This wasn't some hookup, was it? Because, you know, you can say it's none of your business, Freddy. Oh my god. An Aries just walked in. The Ram. Hi, Gollum. Welcome. It's none of your business. I should warn you. It was not a hookup. It was not a hookup. It was definitely not a hookup. I'm allowed to say that much, I think. Pizza? I'm allowed to say. Like you're a secret spy. Get have you been a secret spy this teas. whole time? Because if you have, that's pretty cool. Hi there. Uh, uh, who is this, Grace? Why does he have horns? I don't know. Good question. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be... Honestly, I guess it's as good as mine. To answer your question, my dear, you see the horns because I allow you to see the horns. Oh, his voice is amazing. That's crazy, right? Crazy. As for who I am, I've been known most often as Pan. Peter Pan? So you call me that, if you must call me anything. Okay. Pan, of the Greek gods, Pan, right? What are you, some kind of cosplayer? <laughs> Peach? The days of idols being called gods are well behind us, I'm afraid, but... I assure you, I am the real article. I've come to offer our newest idol a helping hand. Or perhaps two. Okay. You do look lost, don't you? Can we talk in front of Freddy? How can you help? I'm gonna say, were you sent here? Did Athena send you? She didn't say anything, I, I kind of assumed. That you're on your own? Yes, you'd think she'd do a better job of explaining the rules, wouldn't you? <laughs> um, but no, I'm here of my own volition. Okay. Purely out of the kindness of my immortal heart. Don't say the word immortal! I assure you. Not in front of Freddy. Immortal? Shh! Wait, who's immortal? I'm sorry, I'm No one, her. no one. Oh, try not to be upset. It's okay, Freddy. I think. Or uh, maybe it's just easier to say there's nothing you can do to help. How God. is that supposed to make me feel better? What is going on, Grace? I don't know. Let's just go for a walk. Let's get ice cream. The prohibition is against revealing the idols to the mortal world. She's not the mortal world, is she? She can be trusted, can't she? Why do I have the feeling that I'm going to regret not leaving with Brian and Kaz? Oh, I can guarantee it. Um, okay, Freddy, have a seat. Let's talk. Carrie Patton? You guys recognizing his voice? Who is he in The uh, Walking Dead? Huh? That's it? Oh, they told the whole story. Huh? I guess. Do you believe in this, Grace? Uh... This is, oh, interesting, interesting responses. I either go, don't know, I have proof because I was there, or I hope it's all a dream. I want her to believe me, though, so that she can help me. Because I, so if I just tell her that it's like, oh, God damn. The king? He was the king in Walking Dead? Oh, with the tiger? King Ezekiel. Okay, okay. I'm going to say I had proof. Sure, but I had proof. I traveled through a magical door. She did. Which sounds extra cool. <laughs> I was she a seems distracted. like she's invested with me, which well, is good. I have a million questions, but I can ask them later. The important thing is that I am here to support my best friend. Ah. I don't understand the heart thing. She's my best friend. If I click these heart options, does that mean that I'm like 
going past best friendship? And if I do that, or is this, is this, or does that just mean like an affectionate term? Do you know what I mean? Does that just mean that it's like a loving thing to say? I don't think I want to not, I mean, there are other characters. I want to be in love with Calli Calliope, but she's dead. I keep going Calliope because that's what I used to say, the planet. The planet in Star Citizen, I, I call it Calliope, but it's Calliope. But there's also, I mean, there's some very attractive characters back in the immortal world. If I start flirting with my best friend, maybe I close off the avenues with the other characters. <laughs> Only one way to find out. Just romance everyone. What do people get upset? I don't want to hurt anybody. <laughs> You're taking this well. I'm sorry to get you involved. You are the absolute best. Could the heart be linked to your charming persona? Good question, Kat. I, it's actually not because the charming thing is a little green star and then the kick-ass thing is like a little emoji like this and then the smart one is a light bulb. So I already have a different symbol for the charming. So I think the heart must be romance. Welcome, by the way. Nice to meet you. Um, flirt with them all, do it. People, are, they won't get upset if they don't know about it. What is with you today, chat? Who are you? No emotional responsibility from the chat today. Greek gods are always horny. It would be on point. <laughs> Hi, Montresaurus. Stop thinking about it and accept the love. Okay, I'm going to press love and see if it's... I, I'm still not sure if it's flirting or not. So until we know that it seems really flirty, then I, I want to just keep... I'll, I'll keep choosing them to see. What did I ever do to deserve a friend like you? Because this he still seems friendly. At lunch period, dummy. Oh, yeah, right. My friendship comes with all sorts of benefits, up to and including the tracking down still of seems friendly. natural killers. Such darling camaraderie. It brings a tear to my eye. It truly does. Speaking of killers. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You wound me, dear lady. I've come to offer advice to our newest idol, a foundling who is set adrift most cruelly. What's in it for you? So you're here purely for my sake then? Like a charity case? My dear sweet girl, as far as you're concerned, I am the god of charity cases. Mm -hmm. But you're not, are you? Pan was the god of lust <laughs> and mischief. Doesn't sound too charitable to me. Ah, yes. The old tales of the gods. Such antics, such fantasy. Pay them no mind. How do I know you're not the kid? No, no, no. No. How did you know about me? I'm guessing Athena told him. How did you know where to find me? Or know about me at all? You said Athena didn't send you. A little bird told me, if you must know. Very useful, those little birds. He's not gonna tell you, Grace. There's not much to tell. Among the idols, news travels swiftly. We are a tiny village of godly busybodies. Godly busybodies. I heard of your arrival, and I know how obtuse the chorus can be. Can he sing? So here I am. I'm guessing You're he'll welcome. sing soon. Tell me your advice. Okay, I'll bite. What's your advice? I have to admit, I don't really know where to start. Well, I'm not normally one to run amok telling others how to live their lives. But have you considered using your power? I've got powers. My powers. Music, art, passion. You are the last muse. And all these are now your province. I'm going to write a number one hit. That sounds pretty cool. That does sound kind of cool. Like I'm some sort of rock star idol. That is it precisely. You draw music out of others, Grace. Not only with inspiration, but physically. Magically. Okay, but how does that help me find Calliope's murderer? So I make people Allow sing, me to and I will find the murderer. The process of understanding. <laughs> now then, Through song. Close your eyes. You hear that? It's coming from you. When you sing, what emotion does it summon? Um, when I sing, I don't know. What emotion? You does open it your summon? eyes. You look into the crowd. And you feel... Powerful. 
Let's go. Grace, you know that you're lost now. You've been given powers you don't understand. It's giving Prince of Egypt, DreamWorks. I'm the guy who can help you. All that you hear is at your command. Wait, His voice no, is epic. it's okay, Freddy. This is all me? What do I do? I like the tree. Start singing. Now? <laughs> Why not? Try to roll time with it. To Try to roll with it. It's timed. Sing! How the hell did you find me? This is the weirdest night I've ever had. And you say I have powers? How could this possibly turn out bad? Am I doing it now? Brilliant. I don't follow. Girl. Are those really actual don't horns? Control. And this singing is so hard to swallow. <laughs> Can you hear me, Grace? What's going on? Imagine if this gets a stage show afterwards. I know where you belong, Grace, the song, Grace. I can show you the way. Time to play. Where's he taking me? Grace, I have a bad feeling. A grin is a giveaway. That much is clear. What is this creep concern? I'm going to hear him one more time. How does he know you and why is he here? Freddy, this map is uncharted. Let's hear him out. I know how you feel. Me, I'm just getting started. I wish you could feel this. It's kind of unreal. Grace, have you gone delirious? Stranger danger could not be more serious. You've been hurt before by mysterious ah! men. I won't let you get hurt You're right. again. She's right. Maybe she's right. They don't give you much time to pick. I need you to stay. It's not like that. You think you don't need me just cause you can't read me. Believe me, this won't go away. Time to play. Well, that's easy for you to say. It's okay, Freddy. Rip out a solo. Solo, let's go! It's my okay. choice. It's all yours. Okay. I never knew I had that in me that said I'll never do that again. Grace, the lyrics were amazing there. I don't have to pick. Let's let the no! decide. Oh my god, it lets me pause. Is that cheating? I'm sorry, I panicked. I panicked. I panicked. I panicked. I panicked. I panicked. I know I'm cheating. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can pick. Pick my best friend. Pick Pan. Or pick neither of them. If I pick neither of them, do I have to go alone? I can go my own way. Should I? Don't do it. It's already tough. My heart is going. 
I can call. <laughs> oh no. Okay. My heart. My heart. If I choose my best friend, I'm guessing that everything that Pan wants to show me or take me to, I will lose. If I if I choose Pan, then I feel like I abandoned my best friend who's been very, very understanding of the whole situation. Pan could be the killer. It's true. Pan is not to be trusted. I mean, Pan is the god of, didn't they say like mischief and lust and stuff? So, I mean, he's not, he's already not the most trustworthy person, I feel. Pan is sus. <sighs> but he's got a great voice and I kind of want him to sing again for me, you know? Do it for love, Freddy, morality call, you think? Okay, so you guys are feeling... <sighs> Pan will help you with your powers, but he's got his own agenda, that's true. So he could... Maybe there'll be lots of singing, maybe there'll be lots of fun, but he doesn't care about me so much as he does. So much as Freddy would care about me. Oh God. Oh God, I'm gonna choose Freddy. I'm gonna do it. Pan, you've got great horns and great singing voice, but you know, my bestie is my bestie. Sorry to break it to you, Pan, but I'm not abandoning my best friend. Facts! That? That's your choice. Humdrum mortality? Yeah, baby. How about trusting in those who love her instead of those who want to use her? Oh my. Such drama. <laughs> no matter how you employ it, Grace, this is the power of a muse. Drawing out that which lies within. I trust you can see how that might be useful in your investigation. Okay, I've got a charisma option. I'll make them sing a song of confession. <laughs> exactly so. But only if they did it, right? I draw out the truth, not make them lie or do something they wouldn't. Okay, no, so I, I can make natural at this. I, I can, can make tell. people sing their truth. Amuse does not command. She evokes. She elicits. She inspires. Look, Creepo. Grace already told you to take a hike. So she did. Allow me to get to the point then. Let's get. For come all on your then. powers, you still need a place to begin your search. And this I can provide. An address in the city. Where Calliope was staying, I do believe. Seems sus. He could be lying. You should have led with that. <laughs> you should have led with that, Pam. Where was that information before the whole musical number? You have Calliope's address? You should have started with that. And miss all the dancing? Nonsense. <laughs> now this, this I consider a Give favor. it to me. One I hope you'll remember in future dealings. Dealings. That's perfect. We can look for clues there. What this Calliope was doing, who her enemies were. She's tall. I should remind you there is an element of danger. A killer is on the loose, no? I need your help, Pan. Maybe next time, Freddy, then I'll need her help. Uh, then I'll definitely need backup. You'll be fine. After all, what's a mortal to do that you cannot? I, I, I can speak Hindi. Very useful. Okay, fine, I get it. No, it is. I need to find Kaz and Brian. Just tell them you're okay. If uh, not the other stuff. Yeah, let's not fill them in on the I'll rest. Go check this place out on my own. So glad that's settled. I'll let you get to it. I've drinking to resume. Ta-ta. I've drinking to resume. Darpas, let them sing. Let them cook. Let him cook. Hi, I can't pause. He's got his priorities in order. Oh, I see, sorry, okay. The word journal, if I just, I'll take my camera away. The journal is behind me, so I can just switch between them and I wasn't, I didn't understand that. Okay, so journal. If I go to pen. I'm back the morning after going through the ringer, having just discovered that I'm some kind of ancient muse, and guess who shows up at my apartment uninvited, poking around the kitchen like he's considering an investment? This idol's name is Pan, and I don't know what his deal is, he's a bit too smooth. Seems to know a bit too much about what he isn't saying, 
and just happened to know where to point me when he offered for a price, of course. This one's shady, folks. I can just guess what kind of favor he's going to want. Oh! Oh my. Hi, Zam. Hello, AJ. Glad he drew it. I'm a visual learner. <laughs> Do you remember in school they would check whether you were auditory, kinesthetic, or visual? I think I was a doer. I think I was kinesthetic in terms of learning things. Um, I've just realized, sorry, my chat thingy is in the corner. That's probably not helping the dialogue. Let me take it off. There we go. Sorry. Didn't realize I was there. Because you want to be able to read the dialogue. It's probably going over the top. Um, no need to pan, Nick. I get it? I'm so excited to hear Ashley, Anna. I just got here. AJ, Ashley was at the very beginning. We might hear her again. But Ashley Johnson voices the character that just died, that we are trying to work out how she died. She, she died at the beginning. But she sang with us at the very beginning. If you go back on the VOD, um, we had a song together. We had like a duet. Okay, music hide away. Go. So this is the address. I hope that we hear her again. Her voice was beautiful in that as well. Oh, it's open. That's not a good sign. Oh, no. Oh my god, she lived here? Okay! This is Calliope's apartment? I don't know what I was expecting, but... Not this. Um, hello? Oh, sure, Grace, good job. Just announce to the killer that you're here. Subtle. I better have a look around. Oh, I get to pick what to look at. I'm going straight to the harp. Because the harp is iconic and it's in the middle of the room. The rent. Think of the think of the rent, crate. And also think of the electricity bill. Think of the heating. <laughs> Seems vacant, needing a tenant. Sky T's like, could I put a deposit down? I'm willing to put an offer on. Hi, Dilly. Time to move in. I mean, the door's open. No one's in it. How about we all live in there together, chat? Pack your stuff, all right? I'll pick you up individually in about 24 hours. Harp. Confirm. A giant harp. Of course there's a giant harp. That's it? Okay. Oh, the Andy Warhol painting. Andy Warhol, yeah, that makes sense. I wonder how many celebrities <laughs> she knew. Also, what was she doing on Earth? I'm just confused. We've got so many things to find out. Um, guitar, let's go guitar. Can we open the case? Because it's closed. Damn, look at that. That's beautiful. How do you even get one of these? Probably purchase it online, Grace. After Calliope left the audition, where did she go? Did she follow me? Oh did yeah. Did she come here? So the the time between singing with me at the very beginning and then ending up at my apartment door, dead. She must have first first of all she must have followed me home so that she knew where I lived. But then somehow died as well on the way. Did she kill herself? just to give me the powers. I mean, there's uh, so many questions. So many questions. By design and WHS, P-R-S-C-T, and Captain Bear, and One Lonely Gamer, and Jody and Lou. Thank you for the follow. Thank you so much. I find it so hard to read out usernames that have no vowels, so I'm sorry if my, I just read out each individual letter. <laughs> A guitar? That's exactly how you get one. Drums? Freddy's the drummer, right? Right. These aren't... Do I inherit these as the new muse? Is that even okay to ask? Or am I the drummer? Freddy was the drummer. I doubt she followed you. How would she know where I lived? Elegant painting. I don't know if I would call that elegant. Did she paint that? Looks like it belongs in a museum. Does it? Elvis. Who 
want to believe this is just an ironic photo of Elvis and she wasn't like his muse or you ain't nothing but a hound dog crying all the time instrument yeah but there's loads of instruments what instrument are we talking about oh the piano why does it not say piano so many instruments in oh, here in general did she play all of them i bet she could play every single one she was a god <laughs> my name gets quite a few, few people confused is it like whisper is it the word whisper with no vowels so it's like whisper something whisper secret or something whisper i'm trying to think of what it could be or where you got the name from hello dimmy sweet leaf thank you for the follow hello dimmy how you doing dimmy this is dramatic already go upstairs we're going up i don't see anything useful down here Maybe there's something upstairs? Fade out. Fade up. Oh man. Keep it together, Grace. It's just your average, every day. There were only three muses, you know. Not nine. I thought it was Apollo when I saw the back of his head. Whenever they found someone who made something truly masterful or created a new art form, they'd pass on the right one. Take a new name. That's why? That's how the mortals became confused. They got it wrong. Like they got almost everything about us wrong. She gave us her idol on because we were just special? What are you doing here? What are you doing? Sitting here in the dark. What does it look like I'm doing? Booty. Uh, preparing your villainous monologue? It's not a villain. <sighs> I'm grieving. For a dear friend, if I may ask, how did you find this place? And what are you doing here? Pan. I'm gonna say Pan told me about it. I know I have a charisma option, but I wanna know what he thinks about Pan. If I know how the other gods see Pan, it will help me make an informed decision about Pan myself. Hi Mithri, good afternoon, good afternoon. Do we get to hear Troy sing? Absolutely. I, it feels like it's going to happen now. Maybe they duet together. I'm going to say Pan told me about it. Pan told me about it. I was hoping I could find something, some clue about what happened. Y you've already met Pan? Yeah, he came to my apartment. Oh, odd. He just randomly well, at least in. he lifted a finger to help me. For his own gain, maybe, but it's better than nothing. I honestly wish I could help you, Grace. You and Calliope, both deserve better can you tell me about Calliope I want to know what he says about her can you tell me about Calliope I barely knew her but she seemed she was a beautiful soul Apollo is your number one suspect do you think troubled uh, she thought the idols had lost their way she argued with us all of us had they needed to change. She was on the outside of them all. I hadn't spoken in years. I hadn't seen her home before today. I am. Um, I'd rather not talk about it. Sus. Sus behavior. Troy has got a great voice, hasn't he? I know. It's, it's also, it's funny hearing his voice not as Joel, but just him, you know? Um, why did you speak up for me? That's a good question. I should thank you for, you know. Because he stopped me from dying. Speaking up for me. It, it wasn't right, what they were doing. It still isn't. I still need help. I'm not disputing that, Grace. I just don't think that I'm the one to help you. Why? Why can't you help me exactly? Pan said there's no specific rule against it. It's not that I'm forbidden to help you, Grace. It's that you don't want my help. Why? Of course I do! <laughs> you have to know more than me about almost everything! My help will only make things worse. How is that possible? I've been sentenced to death. And without my help, you stand a chance of avoiding that fate. Why is this room such a mess? I love that that's a priority right now. 
Hi, do Fred. Athena is my number one suspect. For the goddess of wisdom, she was ready to kill you way too quick. That's true. For someone that knows more than anyone or anything in the world, for her to go, probably could be you, I'm gonna kill you, seems misplaced. That is interesting, Dufred. Hi, Morkid. Troy is like an annoyingly good actor. Hi, Shuft as well. It, it can't have been us. Is there gonna be like a big twist? Why is this room such a mess? This room is a mess. Did you do this? Not this. I was like this when I got here. Right. And you didn't think that was in the least bit strange? Killer in here. I didn't here. think much of it. I came here to be reminded of Calliope, not to search through her things. That end, it's, uh, it's cleaner than my place. I don't know. He just doesn't sound genuine. I don't know why. I don't know why. So you didn't mess up the room, but someone must have. There could be a clue. No, nothing that I've seen. All this mess, as you put it, is likely the result of her projects. Her projects? Are we suspecting when everybody? Had an idea in her head, she <laughs> would obsess over it. We're Sometimes all like months, even years. Oh, an, an obsessive I don't know what idea. She was involved with lately, but this uh, for her, this is nothing. So it could actually be her that's made the mess because she was just in the zone. So let me get this straight. You'll speak up for me, but you won't lift a finger to help. You don't want me to do more. You keep saying that, but it doesn't make any sense. If you didn't want to help, that'd be one thing. But insisting I don't want you to? <laughs> Why not? Song? Sing to us, Troy. Five, six, seven, eight. I can't do this. Okay, there we go. Charisma option. I predict Apollo is the murderer. Don't trust those abs. Anyone with abs? Untrustworthy. Hi, Emessa. Hello, hello. I mean, he sounds depressed, but I don't understand how he can't be helpful and how, and how he would cause you to be more guilty. Is he one of those people that's like, I'm no good for you. Don't love me. I would be no use anyway. A bit self-indulgent. Maybe one of those. We know those people. I can see this is hard for you, I really can. But I... I don't understand. You don't know what you're asking. I'm just not Do a Do I have guy. to beg? You deserve For better. whatever reason, you helped me before. My life is still on the line. Song? Drama Llama. I, I haven't sung in centuries. According to Pan, I can't force anyone to do she's anything. Making her, she's making him sing with her eyes. That's the power that she's got. Oh! Here we go. Here we go. Phantom pains from a missing friend Feeding thoughts, thoughts that never end What did I do? What didn't I do? Here she is, only in your head Long gone fights, but they're never dead You and Calliope were close? What did I do? What didn't I do? Calliope, what was she to you? Years, thousands of years is coming in facing out finding ways to see beyond what's dead reaching ahead yeah that was 
you guys I think it is the game don't worry I don't think it's you you need to show words aren't the same never the same but I've tried never with me we haven't tried Was that a yes, your help? Let's see. So it's yes, you'll do this. Yes. It's time, time to move. She'd approve. She is gone. It's time for change. Never the same. Troy Baker and Lighthouse's bad combo. <laughs> that hidden voice, it will oh always God. play. On a loop, it'll always say, what did I do? that he's like oh i've not sung for years i Very just well, i'll help i can't sing no um, what did i do expect me to do athena called you the god of prophecy didn't she isn't that telling the future <laughs> prophecy is the last thing you need grace <laughs> sounds like it'd be useful there you go again can you explain why okay after the song do you feel like he's less sus now Do you think it could be this? It could be that it's not him anymore. What did I do? Kinda more sus. You find him more suspicious after the song. Saxy Savvy, thank you for tier three for twenty three months. Quick pop up while at work. Oh, Savvy, thank you. Nice, thank you for tier three. It's just such a long time at tier three. I don't know what to say. Two years almost. Thank you so much for tier three. It's such such extra support. You've no idea how much it means to me. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, I can turn it down a little bit. It might be because it's not released that um, the version that I have might just be that it's clipping a little bit. I've never had, I've never had a game that I've played do that so far so it, that's why it make it's i don't think it's obs for that reason because i think if i was playing when, when i play anything else it would also uh be peaking a little bit so i don't think i don't think it's me but because my mic is also not either is it um he didn't do it he's too sad to have done it okay so cat is believing that he did not i wonder if the guilty party can change between playthroughs so you think maybe the culprit could change depending on who's playing it can we whip no not over the music strictly why would you want to whip over this gorgeous song he seems genuinely sad cody thank you for the follow thank you so much some voice lines are doing it too steph's the game yeah i think it just might be the game but it might be um by the time it's released that might be gone i've seen too many of this kind of thing he's not sus okay so okay wow raj can we do a poll can we do a poll 
whether Apollo is sus or not sus. I want to see what you guys think. I want to see what you guys think. What did I do? I'm going to put that there. Um, I'm going to say, can you explain why? It'd be helpful if you could explain why exactly. This is all new to me, remember? Yes, of course, that's true. It's so easy to forget that. To receive a prophecy is not simply to be told what might happen, it's to be told what will happen. To know a prophecy is to be bound a to its outcome. Only in ignorance is one free to choose. Oh, if I had the clever perk, then I could say you're talking about fate. Why is the poll not showing up in my thing? That's weird. The poll's not showing for me. <laughs> Jay. Oh my god, Jay, welcome in. <laughs> Arrive into the chat to an open-shirted man, fan self. Um, welcome to the stream and welcome to Apollo. Apollo be beautiful. Joanna, thanks for the follow. Nice to meet you. Welcome to the welcome to the coop, baby. Um, I'd be an awful detective because those vocals make me want to say he's innocent. Imagine if every criminal could sing its way, could sing their way out of um, a conviction. You get to the courtroom and they're like, did you do it? And then they start breaking into song. You don't see either? Refresh? Oh, maybe it didn't come up for me either. A poll low. Get it? Uh, I'm going to say, how does that work? What? That makes no sense. If you tell me I'm going to fall into a hole. Then you will. No, but I'll just avoid holes. All holes. Any hole. And the act of trying to avoid them is what will make you fall. Worse. He's suddenly got a lot to say now. He's gone from being like, I don't want to talk about it. To Sometimes you won't understand the full meaning until it's too late. Can you help another way? Okay. Is there anything you can do that isn't prophecy related? Uh, not directly, but yes, possibly. Come with me. There's someone I'd like you to meet. New character. New character. We're going to meet a new... F oh, we're going to the beach. He brought you flip-flops? Good. Hello? Hello? I didn't bring my this towel. This is where you live? Oh, yes. Sometimes. And, and excuse the mess. I, I don't get many visitors. What a lie. Look at you. Ah. No one ever comes round with my eight pack looking like Thor. Just don't get many guests. Never have anyone round. No one wants to hang out with me. I'm no good for you. Choose someone else. Aren't idols rich? Closes up his shirt slowly. Apollo is a slob, I'm out. <laughs> No housekeeping? No love from Jay. Yes, tantalizing, I agree. Are idols broke? <laughs> In all those years, you couldn't save up enough money to afford a housekeeper? <laughs> well, I guess I never worried about it much. Maybe I should. Maybe you should. You if said you, I'm here to meet If you someone? want to have more uh, visitors, yes. I would recommend um, cleaning the house a little bit. Do you know bit. what an oracle is? And maybe, you know, not graffitiing inside the house. Maybe that would also help. I don't know. Troy Baker never gets visitors, sure. 65% <laughs> of the chat thinks Apollo is not sus. 35% think he is. Okay, I think the song probably won a lot of you over then. What did I do? A fortune teller? Not really. Not really. Let me guess. Another idol? Not quite. They serve as a channel of sorts for my powers. What's his power, though? This allows them to offer insight, knowledge they have no earthly means to what possess. What is he wearing? There's always been one. Over the ages, no matter the where chinos I go, The chinos with the flip-flops? One manages to find me. Meaning there's an oracle here. Oh, sorry, my bad. There is. Fridge? Hello? What? I have brought someone to see you. Hey, friend. How many times do I have to tell you? I'm not a magic fortune cookie. 
Is that what Paul told you? Oracle's my handle. And even if I was the Oracle, I'm certainly not his Oracle. Okay, that voice, I, I know that voice. Is that, um, the voice? I think that voice of, I think that voice is in, um, Arcane. <laughs> She's Google IRL. It's Mass Effect? Ash from Mass Effect? Kimberly Brooks? Is that, is, is she in Arcane at all? Because that, that is just planted a voice in my head from something that I feel like I've watched that wasn't video game related. What did I do? Kimberly Brooks. She was in Arkham Asylum. Huh, maybe not Arcane then. Okay, sorry. I just had a moment. I had to, I had to listen to it. I had to listen to it. Lovely to meet you. There we go with the Riz. With my charisma. It's a pleasure to meet you, Oracle. Hmm. Well, she's got better manners than the last lady you brought here. But at least that one had a casserole. Do you have a casserole? I... Uh, no, I would no. prefer lasagna. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. She was Sky Look, and Arcane? I'm sure he told you all sorts of nonsense. Big brain. I use computers. I'm a hacker. That's it. I ask very little of you, Oracle. <laughs> Your help here would be appreciated. Put down Valorant and help us. Fine. Don't get your abs in a twist. <laughs> okay. So Paul brought you all this way just to see little old me. What's on your mind, sis? You keep calling him Paul. Yeah, why is he called Paul? You keep saying Paul. Do you mean Apollo? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Apollo, if that is his real name, says he's a god of prophecy, blah, 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 blah. But you don't believe him. Yes, young Sky, <laughs> the young one. Believe yeah, yeah, yeah. him? Uh, who'd believe that? <laughs> it's super weird, but he's a decent guy, so he can be Apollo if he wants, but I just can't call him that. Um, hello, Nathalian. Did I get that wrong or right? Welcome to the coop. Um, hello, Barb, as well. She never sounded like this before. I can always recognize her, but not this time. Sky Young and Arcane. She was in Mass Effect. Don't get your abs in a twist. Can you imagine? Oh, just like two abs all twisted up. Ouch. Ouchie. I don't like your name, so I'm going to call you something different. Oh my god, fun fun story again. It's so funny how all of my, like, for some reason, my high school relationship stories have been coming up. I, when, when we were playing the, the other game the other day, the guy, the exchange student came up in when we were playing Final Fantasy. But I had a boyfriend when I was 17 in high school. And I quote, I just will never forget that he said this to me. It was the strangest thing ever. Out of nowhere, he said, um, do you want to know the one thing about you that I would change? First of all, not leading well. It's not something I would want to hear anyway. And then he said, um, your name. And I was like, my name. And he said, he said, I just hate the name Anna. What a <laughs> the, the emoji. I was like, really? For context, his name was James. It's not like he was called, I don't know. It's not like his name was, I don't know, Rex. <laughs> I was like, okay. I was like, thank you for sharing. Needless to say, it did not work. Strong wording. <laughs> Needless to say, the relationship did not work. Okay, James. <laughs> Do you want to know the one thing about you I would change? No, I don't actually, James. Thank you. Back to my revision. I'm gonna focus on my A-levels. <laughs> Huge red flag. Okay, James. Sky, you just cracked me up with that. Okay, sorry. I got distracted. You live here? Question mark? Do you live here? Do they live together here I in this hellhole. Yeah. Better here than home. She showed up one day, as the oracles do. Naturally, she is welcome to stay as long as she likes. And see the way he talks. I thought maybe he was a creep at first, but nah. Pause I I Paul's I the highest of praise. He'd be more all right if he did some laundry. I was gonna say. I was gonna say. 
There's such a strange um, pairing, almost, those two. I didn't imagine that they would, like, spend a lot of time together than in this little house. <laughs> Thanks for sharing, but I'm not accepting feedback at this time. James, go shave a leg. <laughs> oh, dear. Did he suggest a name he would prefer? Can you imagine? He was like, so I'm not feeling Anna. Could we instead call you Elizabeth? Could we go with Jemima from now on? Because I would much prefer that. All the Jameses in chat. By the way, I'm not saying James is a bad name. I'm just saying that James, I feel like, is a pretty regular name. So then saying that Anna was a shit name felt weird. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Jemima? <laughs> Lucinda? <laughs> okay, how well do you know Apollo? Tell me, is Apollo Also, how old is Oracle? Is she young? Incredibly emo? Like a sack stuffed with sad? I am standing right here. He's quite emo to be Don't get me wrong. It grows on you after a while. Grace, surely this is not what you came for. Baby, this is what you came for. This is fun. Okay, is this also a flirting option? Am I flirting with Apollo now? I just don't understand. Every single time I press the heart, it doesn't feel flirty. So I'm going to click it again just to see if it is. Hang on. Oh, I don't know. It's cute watching you get all flustered. Oh, shit. Well, <laughs> it's hardly productive. Oh, no. Is it? See, there you go again. <laughs> oh, no. Ugh. Get a room. Don't worry. A different room. I don't want Apollo. I'm good. Don't worry. Not with a, not with a house like this. Not with a house like this. You have no choice in the matter anyway. It's as if he was complaining about height or eye color. M with my name, Busty? Yeah, like, it's not like he... Like, I, I can't change my name. That's the thing. I can't change it at all. It's not like I can be like, oh. That was that was a little strong. <laughs> he has a high necklace to red flag ratio. Oh my god, quote. I love that. Yes. Okay, so the heart is flirting. Even though, for some reason, when we do that with Freddy, Freddy's like, bestie. Bestie vibes. Also, I don't know about Freddy because Freddy I've grown up with from like school. I don't know. It feels like it feels weird flirting with their best friend there because they've grown up together. It feels like the wrong place to start flirting randomly. Stop flirting, Spuzzy. Okay. Um, I need information. I'm looking for information about someone named Calliope. Yeah. Can you help? Can you help me? Oh, the lady from that apartment I sent Paul to. Yes. Yeah. Let me check that out. What did I tell you? I looked it up. You could do the same if you learned to use a computer. He's a yeah. god. Hold up, I'll he needs a laptop you. now? He just got, he's got you to do it. There. The apartment was originally purchased two years ago by a holding company. Core with a K. Enterprises. Core. Oh. oh, I see. Persephone. That would be Persephone. Mommy? The one from the chorus? Persephone is in the one from the chorus. The one who wanted me dead, Persephone. Yeah. I wasn't aware Persephone and Calliope were friendly. Certainly not friendly enough for Persephone to give Calliope an apartment. Was it alone, or...? The good news is that Persephone is easy to find. I can take you to her if you like. I feel like a lot of you are going to fancy Persephone. If you've not seen her before, you will in a second. She's badass, bitch. Um... Should I say I'd rather go alone? <laughs> I start off flirting with him accidentally and now I'm like, I'm just going to go by myself. Thank you, though. Um, I'm going to say you're helping me now. Whatever happened to, I can't help you, Grace. I'll just make it worse, Grace. Fridge? I admit, you've got me curious. Oh, calling card. Great. We're all done now. Thank you for your help, Oracle. Please. Do try to get out from behind your screens at least once today. Okay, Dad. Perhaps go for a walk. Yeah, yeah, sure, will do. Leave a tip on your way out. Sounds like a doctor trying to cure depression. Go for a walk. Get off your phone. Oh, 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 is that a bar? Underworld. Does Persephone run a nightclub? Because that would not be surprising. Touch grass, Oracle. Troy told us to touch grass. Have you just tried not being sad? Do I see Amelia as well? Welcome in, Amelia. Nice to see you. 
Treat him mean. Keep him keen. Okay, let me just quickly go to the journal and read about Oracle. Is Oracle got a... Oh, Oracle does not have a thingy. But Apollo's been updated, possibly. Oh, 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 we've got loads of entries now. He said he didn't do it and that he was there mourning Calliope. They were close for a long time, it seems, but a rift began between them a couple of years ago that it never, and it never quite healed. Was it the kind of rift that might lead to her murder? So they fell out. Why? <sighs> okay. Speaking of, what, does, what do we have on Persephone right now? This is Persephone. Badass. First of all, we've got the power suit. We've got a power suit going on. It's like a, a, like a mauve waistcoat pant matching situation. Then, almost like a kimono over jacket, exposed bra, golden jewelry. Undercut, slick eyeliner, black lipstick. Just talking you through it. <laughs> According to the Oracle, Persephone owns the apartment she was living in. So they knew each other, question mark? They were close, question mark? Okay. Uh, whatever it is, it's pretty, sh it's pretty clear that Persephone hates me. And not just because she thinks I'm a murderer, because they don't all think that. It feels personal. Those sharp eyes of hers wanted to gut me and hang me on a clothesline. So I better watch my back. Fuck you now. Okay, we're going to the underworld to go talk to Persephone. Are you ready? Hey, ostrich. The power lace. I know, it's very, it's a statement. Statement piece. Absolutely. MTN, thank you for the follow. Peach, thank you for gifting a sub to Naughty Ostrich. Oh my god, the two naughties in chat. We've got Naughty Ostrich and Naughty Peach. What a combination. Do ostriches eat peaches? Because that would be, oh. I mean, oh. Careful. Careful, Peach. We won't need to stay alive in the chat. This feels like a club. Yeah, there we go. She owns a club. She owns a club. Is it like a stand-up comedy? Welcome to the underworld. underworld. Wow. How have I never heard of this place? Is it like a... Persephone keeps it a secret. While still managing to draw a crowd every night. Don't ask me how. Small crowd. Here in the underworld, idols can be themselves. Even if they don't look human. Right. The gods can have a night out. On occasion, yes. <laughs> Dilly, no, I know that already. Hello, Wyatt. I'm having a great day. Persephone looks like Marisha Ray's Critical Role Campaign 2 character, Beauregard. Okay, I just read a load of words that I didn't understand, but I am guessing other people will understand what you mean. Persephone's one of my favorite characters in Hades Town. A lot of, I saw, so I watched the trailer for this on YouTube before we played it uh, a few weeks ago, back when I first heard about it. And the top comment said, this looks like a cross between Hades the game in terms of art style and then Hades Town the musical in terms of music. Double Hades. It's a quiet crowd, yeah, it looks quite quiet actually. Um, is it dangerous? There are idols here other than Persephone? Almost guaranteed. Okay. Is it dangerous? Pan's there. It shouldn't be. But before Calliope, I would have said an idol getting murdered was next to impossible. That's true. I was if wondering. Where to find Persephone and all this? So easy we'll to need kill. to split up. Have you considered what you'll say to her? Why has it got anything to do with him? I'll be persuasive. I'll figure something out. I can be persuasive when I want to be. I'm aware. I'm just not sure even you could sweet talk Persephone. Let me try. <laughs> Is that a challenge? <laughs> it's the truth. If Persephone really was friends with Calliope, talking to you might be the last thing she wants. You need to be prepared to use your powers, as you did with me. Come find me in the crown if you need anything. Okay, we need to get Persephone Otherwise, to sing. Be careful, Grace. Thanks, Apollo, for nothing. I mean, sorry, what? All abs and no help. Talk to Pan. Hey, bro. Long time no see. Welcome in, Sam, by the way. As I live and breathe, if it isn't our dear muse. Hi, Pam. What up? Tell me, have you decided to leave your troubles behind and join us in the land of shadows and revelry? 
No. I need to find Persephone. Do you know where I can find her? You must know why I'm here, right? Let me guess. You seek our sweet-natured proprietress. Can you help me find her? <laughs> proprietress <laughs> is such a good word. I wasn't good enough, but now, now, I see how it is. Where is he? By all means. I'd love to tell Persephone that the source of her rage has intruded on Why her am brain. I the source of her rage? I haven't, I genuinely haven't done anything. I don't understand why she could hate me. I hope that we find out during her musical number because there is literally no reason why. Cole and Sam, thank you for the follow so much. I want to sweet talk Persephone. <laughs> I hope that we find out why she hates me so much. Okay, what if I ask nicely? What if I asked you really nicely and batted my eyelashes like so? <laughs> oh no. Not my one true weakness. Kryptonite? I could also flatter you, tell you how shiny your horns are. All right, all right. My, my. <laughs> Never let Not the horns. said that flattery gets one nowhere. Let me know when you're ready and I'll take you to Persephone. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Do keep that in mind after you've spoken to her. Okay, I was wondering if I could talk to other people as well. Eros. Who was Eros again? Was Eros... I should talk to them all. Excuse? Um, oh my god, Martin. Ten months, thank you so much. Billy, thank you for 100 bits as well. Thank you so much for the resub, Martin, as well. Welcome back again. Who voices Grace? This is uh, Laura Bailey. We've also, uh, Calliope, the death of which we are investigating, is voiced by Ashley Johnson. Apollo is voiced by Troy Baker. So we've got the whole cast of The Last of Us in here. Um, we've got some incredible Broadway singers. The music is uh, by a Grammy-nominated composer. So much is happening. It's so exciting. It's so exciting. Um, not the horns. It's hitting all the bases, Wyatt. I'm going to talk to Eros. Who is Eros again? Ooh, look at that thigh! He's not skipping leg day. Whoa. I'm so excited to play this game. Oh my God, Cole. It's really good so far. Oh, okay. We've got a bleached top half, dark beard. Oh, hey. You're the new muse, aren't you? Uh, that's uh, Abu. Like, that's my friend I Abu. Am, yeah. Aphrodite mentioned it. I can recognize it. Didn't figure I'd see you here. Though. His voice is so deep. Oh, excuse the manners. Name's Eros, God of Seth. Um. Okay. My, my. I should go? <laughs> that makes sense. He's got a great voice. I should go. Imagine being like, I'm Eros, god of sex. And we're like, thank you, bye. Um, I'm gonna say there's a god of sex, question mark, even though I know there's a god of sex. Hey, did you did you say that you're, that you're the god of sex? Desire, really. Sensuality. Attraction. Why? Were you expecting a chubby little flying baby with a bow and arrow? <laughs> uh, I, I wasn't. I actually preferred Cupid, but Pan had to be the trickster. Spread all those stupid stories. I'm sorry. <laughs> Why? It's not your fault. Just another grudge I get to carry around forever. Were you expecting a chubby little baby with a bow and arrow? Actually, yes. <laughs> Hi, Mira. Leave the cherubs out of this. What are you doing here? How do you know Aphrodite? Oh, I, I mean, I think I'm sure I, I'm sure I know why. You know Aphrodite, right? I only met her the once. Sure, she's oh. my mother. You know how it is. How would I know? Oh, that's not what oh, I- Oh, here, remember? That's not what I thought. Oh, right, right, yeah, sorry. sorry. I wasn't thinking. But you hear a lot of idols talk about each other like that. You know, mother, brother, sister, grandfather. Family tree. None of us are actually related. We're just 
played a family for so many centuries. It may as well be true. Right. Okay. Mother, mommy, bracket literally. So Aphrodite is your mother, but, but not really. Not really. That's right. A long time ago, she took care of me when I needed taken care of. Oh, grumpy, that's nice. The mortals, they just assumed. These days, well, it's not like that anymore. His outfit is not as invulnerable as we used to be. Something else. Least of all, Aphrodite. He's got a purple leopard print um, harness. My god. What are you doing in here? The god of sex at a club. Looking for someone? Mm, once I might have, sure. Once? Now I'm just here to see it happen. Excuse see me? See what happened? Look out there. See all these people. The hope, the anticipation, the connections, they bounce off each other. <laughs> to me, it's like lightning. That's a bit creepy. You enjoy that? Sounds like fun. I'm going to ask him. I'm going to say you, you enjoy that. you enjoy that? I used to make it happen, you know. Mortals once begged me to make it happen, to inspire true love. But now, now I only inspire sex. Not the same thing. They're not the same thing. It's just as well. People should find true love the hard way. They'll value it more. Okay. Is everything okay? You seem a little distracted. <laughs> Is everything okay? <laughs> of course it is. Sure. No, it's not. Mm, not obvious, huh? No, what's wrong? Come on. Truth is, I don't come here that often. It was hard to get away. I just... No, never mind. Okay, he's closed off. He's closed off. Do we push him for an answer? His harness has a bow and arrow cupid on it. Does it actually? Tell that to Tinder. So he's just, he likes going to a club and watching everyone else hit on each other, is what he's saying. Yeah, AJ, him and I went to drama school together. He was the year above me, when, so when I was in second year, he was in third year. And um, we both loved video games. We would always talk about video games together. And, and then he graduated, he did really well. He got the lead in Assassin's Creed Origins. And um, he's just been going from strength to strength. He's done so, so well. People watching, but spicy people watching. Okay, I'm gonna say you can talk to me because I have charisma. I'm willing to listen if you need to talk. I appreciate that. Oh? Maybe some other time. Shit! It's too much. Too much. I'll see you around. Count on it. Not like that. Not like that. Oh, talk to Persephone. I can talk to her now. She's there at the bar. She's intimidating as hell. If you're angry with anyone, Persephone, be angry with me. It was I who- I will deal with you later. I was willing to leave you be, Grace. To wait until your guilt was certain. So she thinks it's me. And yet here you are, in my domain, uninvited. She thinks I did it. Why? Are you here to beg for mercy? Are you here to challenge me? Should I be afraid? <laughs> Grace's face is how I feel. <laughs> Have you ever seen anyone look more frightened than Grace in this specific scenario? Mary Elizabeth McGlynn, yes. Who, she voices, um, or she does, well, maybe Raj, you can tell me. I recognize the name though. Hello, Darth. That height difference though. Mommy? I don't want to fight, I have questions. What is your problem? I'm gonna go confrontational because she's got a problem and I wanna talk about it. What is your problem with me exactly? You've had it in for me the moment you saw me. My problem? <laughs> My problem is that I'm filled with questions, Grace. Filled to the brim. Do you really expect us to believe that Calliope chose you? What's the real story? 
Did you stumble across her as she lay dying and desperate? No. Are you an accident? No. Did you learn what she was? Yes. Did you torture her? No. Hold her at the point of death yes. until she agreed to hand over her Eidolon? No. Persephone, this isn't... That's my problem, Grace. With you. And you can't make it go away. Calliope lived at your apartment. The whole cast is wildly amazing, I know. Just lay down and play dead. Gal! Gal, are you home? <laughs> Mark me down as scared and horny. <laughs> Cole is like, I'm feeling everything. Everything at once. Um, Mary was in Cowboy Bebop, also a very prominent guest on Critical Role. Wow, so you've got all the, a lot of Critical Role and Last of Us going on and Broadway and all sorts of stuff. Hi, Billy. Where's the button to propose marriage immediately to this very tall woman? Um, I think it's R1. Billy, I'm joking. I, I wish I knew. I would do it for you, I promise. Calliope lived at your apartment. You knew Calliope. We all knew Calliope. She was staying at your apartment. Landlady. You knew her. Better than I or anyone else suspected. Are you implying that I had something to do with her death? Prove you didn't. That's how idols work, isn't it? Oh, she's walking off. Okay, that went well. That went really well. Oh, she's singing! <laughs> you hear that? You're in my house, little muse. Little? You want answers? Fight for them. A lost little girl. You shouldn't have come here. And I sure ain't in the mood to make new friends. Five, six, seven, eight. Go home, little girl. Mo, thank you for two years. The thank you so much. Near. Thank you. And you all alone, we both know how this ends. Drums. Ah! Let's see how far she bends. I'm gonna go on the attack. How this ends. I want to. Come on, let's go. Come on, attack. I think she'll respect me more if I fight. You know, I feel like she'll respect me more. Uh -huh. Is this thing on? Testing one, two, testing three. Is this thing on? Are you testing me with your coterie? Ogling expectantly. Heads up, wrecking me won't come for free. See, it won't be easy, Persephone. When I use the moves, I bring blessedly. Shadows don't scare me. See, I'll survive it. Maybe you want to do this in private. You're lost, little girl. You're wasting our time now. Okay. The gall of a squeaking mouse in a lion's den. She slayed it. She slayed Give it. Up, little girl. The bus home is leaving. I've seen it so many times. We all know how this ends. We all know fight back. How it ends. I like the fight. I want them to be like. Go on. Persephone, oh boy, a celebrity dissing me. Now remind me, Peach, of my memory. Sorry, not upon my ancient history. Underworld, now that rings a bell. Was it you who was married to the king of hell? It's hazy, Hades, so you're his lady? Before my time, because I'm such a baby. Please teach me my ABCs, me. I never featured in Euripides. So where are they now? Wow, well, look around. You're the big cheese of a hole in the ground. Don't you have Am I gonna get myself in more trouble? Don't call me child. Surprise, surprise. Coins on your eyes. Give them to the fairy man. Where am I? Get it in your little head. Why am I in the Grand Canyon? You're spitting at the queen. What would Calliope say? I'm trying to be nice now. The question, who else I'm trying to be nice. 
at last to little girl. Dark and fight your endless war. Finish with you Certain now. you can't be surprised anymore. You've sung us your little song. You know, there's someone else that I speak for. But we've heard it. Do you hear that? Oh. She had something to say. I feel your pain. Turn her I'm gonna be nice. Away. Please don't do this. You're lost, Persephone. You've buried yourself. The strings. On stage in the blinding lights. You're hiding here. You ate a bad seed. That's not on me. Rotten too long, blossomed all wrong. You change shape. In time, you'll see. She's trying to decode her personality. Into who we will be. I wouldn't Your do that. Youth wasn't stolen like it was from me. Oh. Let me help you. Don't touch me. Shit. I don't need help from any of you. I was alone. When you know who kidnapped and crushed all my dreams till the muse. Let Persephone win. I just want Calliope. She's not back. gone, she's in me, I'm gonna say that. She's not gone. I'm so stressed! Am I pressing the wrong thing? She does live on. Majesty, do you understand who I am? Who I am? Who I am? The type of song changes entirely depending on what you pick. So if, if you go fight, then it turns into like a rap. And if you do Calliope, she sings, and then this one's more kind of like jazzy. You know? You know? Hey, Voldemort. No. How do no, you you've mean? earned your answers. Known for in what way? Welcome. Yeah, this would be amazing as a stage musical as well, I think. Calliope came to me years ago. She'd grown tired of arguing with the idols, tired of being branded a troublemaker. She couldn't watch the idols wither away without a fight. Is this why someone killed her? I knew how she felt. So I gave her the apartment. Okay, so out of the goodness of her heart... Out of the goodness of her heart, she gave her the apartment. Hey, by design, welcome to stream. I hope they make a TV series of this. The art style is all hand-drawn, it's amazing. I'd love to know, I'd love to know who drew who like designed it. I guess it'd be a team, but it's so amazing. You sound stronger than I thought you would. You sound stronger. As in like, stronger? Or as in, stronger. Hi, look, it's Hunter. Okay, I'm gonna say no conflict at all. That's it? No fights, no conflict of any kind? Why would there be? Because you're because aggressive. You were you, Persephone. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. No, not recently. Calliope and I haven't spoken for at least two years. After I heard the news, I went to the apartment and turned it upside down. That's I had why it was a mess. Truth. She went in and turned it upside down. That was you. I didn't find anything. Nothing to say what she had been involved with, or or gotten into, or who she might have been fighting with. You still think I did it? So what now? Do you still think I'm guilty? The jury's still out on whether Calliope chose you, but do I think you killed her? No. Yes! If it wasn't Grace, that means someone else was behind Calliope's death. Someone who could keep their involvement hidden. One of us. One of us. One of us. Shouldn't we tell Athena? 
must it be an idol? It's true, because it could be... I mean, could a human, could a mortal kill Calliope? Or would it, would it have to have been one of the gods? You know? <laughs> this is next level false world problems. Well, it's like uh, alternate world problems because a god is dead. Persephone is innocent, innocent because I'm in love with her. Okay, so that immediately means that she's not guilty. Um, shouldn't we tell Athena? Oh no, I'm gonna ask her whether it should, whether it needs to be an idol of, uh, at all. I've never heard of a human killing a Greek god. True. So it must not be a person then. Does it have to be an idol? You thought I killed Calliope. Couldn't it have been some other mortal? Despite how we might look, it's not a simple matter to kill an idol. Mm. It was difficult enough to believe you had done it. Right. If another mortal killed her, they somehow escaped detection. We found nothing, no evidence of a battle. You looked? Of course we looked. What do you think was happening while you waited? If Calliope was attacked elsewhere, even magic revealed no trace of it. What if she did it to herself? Why are we why are we not thinking about how she might have done it to herself? What if she thought what if she met me and thought she's gonna be the one to help the idols do what I think the idols need to do? And I'm not the right person. So she just showed up at the door and passed on her gift so that we Was it Kratos? Enemies? Did Calliope have- Yeah, that's a good question, actually. Did Calliope have any enemies? The way you talk about her, she must have. She was a strong character. So maybe people didn't like her. Oh! What? What am I both missing? of them went quiet. Well, Calliope had a way of making people angry. See? She could be... argumentative. Yes, but enough to make enemies who wanted her dead? Not that you or I know of, apparently, but that doesn't mean they didn't exist. Could Athena be the killer? Shouldn't we tell Athena? What about Pan? Did you say magic? Yeah, let's get magic. Wait, wait, wait. Did you say magic? You can battle me through a song in a world of your own creation. And yet magic is beyond belief? <laughs> well, sure. True, she's I just right. Thought... We have our powers just as you have yours. I can grow a field of corn like nobody's business. Weird flex, but okay. Some would say our powers are also magic, but <laughs> true magic is a different and older <laughs> power. Okay. Hecate's domain. And it was of no use here. Oh, Hecate. We shouldn't rule it out. We haven't tried everything yet. I love that everyone's flexing their different powers, and she's like, I can grow a field of corn just like that. I'm like, okay. Just the, just corn? Exclusively corn. <laughs> Persephone, the god of corn. It's corn. Steel bro, thank you for the follow. Thank you so much. The corn I summon is so ripe, you don't even know. I love corn. Corny flex. She's the corn god. I love that she was just like, well, you don't even know what I can do with corn. What about like, maybe like, I don't know, peppers, tomatoes, peas, carrots, anything else? Just corn. Uh, what about Pan? I'm gonna see what she says about Pan. What about Pan? He showed up at my place out of nowhere, right after I left the chorus. He did what? Yes! I have to wonder what his angle is. He has one, that's for certain. Though I've never thought of him as a killer. No, I don't think it's Pan. It would be- Oh, sorry. Shit, did I skip it? I pressed the button accidentally, I'm sorry. I skipped it. You're both still suspects. I don't think that's gonna help saying that right now, Grace. I don't think Pan did it. If I'm leaning, if I'm leaning towards anybody at this time, it's Apollo for some reason. I just think he's uh, a little sus. But shouldn't we tell Athena? Could Athena be the killer? Is that? Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna just say. It. I don't think they will like me saying it, but I'm gonna try. What about Athena? She seemed awfully insistent on declaring me guilty. Don't you think? Athena? <laughs> no, Athena follows the rules. Okay. Well. Athena has one goal and one goal only: to protect the idols. And that included Calliope. She'll eventually drive us all mad with her vigilance, but break her own rules? I don't see it. Okay. Shouldn't we tell Athena that? Couldn't we go to Athena with this? If you've changed your minds and you're both part of the chorus... Athena would be sympathetic, but... The die has been cast. 
She won't go back on the edict, not without clear evidence. Okay, so we don't go to oh, Athena until we know. Oh, now you want evidence. She acted on the information she had. If we want to sway her, we need something better. Fair. This feels pointless. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. You know the idols. Don't you have any ideas? I told you I wouldn't be of much help, Grace. Did you now? Mm. That's unsurprising. When are you ever of help to anyone but yourself? Says the woman who forced Grace to challenge her rather than answer a simple question. Calliope died, Apollo. Calliope, who came with us all the way from the old world. You think I don't know that? Are you forgetting what the muses meant to me? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go Charisma. This won't help Calliope. Please, both of you! None of this will help Calliope! I know you both miss her. I know you cared about her, but she's not completely gone. A piece of her is in me. She came to me for help, and I don't want to die any more than she did. Oh my gosh. We get another song. It is Laura and Troy, yeah. You would do. Blinded by fire, one match did you strike that consumed you? What match did you strike that consumed you? I love that line. Don't you blame her? What could she have done to earn such a fate? You are blinded. God of the sun hides from his own eyes. What would you know about fate? Am I gonna pick my Say that you knew her, she was family to us, and you don't hesitate to accuse her. Oh, queen without a throne, go bitter with fury. We've overlooked Everyone something. seeks to betray you. Stop this. There is something missing we're blinded to. Yes, there's more to see. Apollo, your help is not needed here. Go ahead and abandon another muse. How could you throw that gauntlet at me? Could your heart shrivel any further? You abandoned me to a, a terrible, terrible fate. fate. You replay your injuries it's till it's too, too late. late. You know how far I've been before I, I snapped. This, this is, is Apollo, calm down. Enough! This helps no one. There he is, God of the Sun. <laughs> Take a deep breath. I need your help. That was scary. Not your anger. These old wounds, they distract and blind you. You can't see yourselves. He doesn't know what's important. And you do. Stay with Persephone. Yes, I'm going to stay with her because I think Apollo is unhinged. Or stay. Oh my god. Help. I don't know if this is wrong or not. I'm staying with her. Now that Apollo isn't sucking all the oxygen out of the room, <laughs> perhaps we can get somewhere. Oh no, he stormed off. Was all that necessary? I'm gonna say he got a bit scary, because he did. The way he got all ragey. That was a surprise. The glimpse you had, that anger, that's the true Apollo. The one behind his mopey exterior. Remember it. I'll admit the problem you present is. I mean, if he's that aggressive, maybe he is a if suspect. If an idol is behind Calliope's death, anger is very sus. I know, Spurious. Hella I sus. Need time to formulate a plan. What's she drinking? Whiskey? You're gonna help me? Maybe they're gonna be best friends now. Maybe. Maybe. I feel bad for my IRL best friend in the real world now. I feel like Freddie would have fun if she was with, with us. You've decided to help me then? I wasn't sure you would. Well, what should I say? That I've changed my mind? Hi, that TDK. Calliope might have chosen you after all? No, it's just... You have fight in you. You've I... taken quickly to the muse's power. I do, I do. It's possible that she saw the potential. She definitely so, did. Yes, I'll help you. Oh. If, however, this has all been a desperate deception. Well, let's hope it doesn't count. Could I have a glass? This is better than fighting you. We can flirt with Persephone. 
Shall I just do every single flirt option and just see where it takes us? It could absolutely get us into hot water. Not in a, not in that way. Don't make it weird. I mean, it could just. <laughs> also, TDK, yes, Troy Baker. I mean, if you think about it, both Ellie and Joel in The Last of Us, they sing in the game at different times. So they, we already knew they could sing from The Last of Us. Flirt? Everyone's like, please, God. Okay, I'm sorry to do this at this specific moment, but I have got to pee because I had two cups of tea before stream. So I've got to pee. I'll be literally right back. Please. I'm going to put it on this screen so that you can create anticipation. Wait, what if it automatically times... It better not automatically pick one after a while. I'm going to do that just in case. Just in case. Hot water floating. <laughs> give, me, give me one second. Behave yourselves. Behave. And then we're going to... We'll flirt with Persephone when I come back. I promise. Okay, I'm back. Are you ready? I know you're chomping at the bit. Ah, oh, I might get on some prey in here in a bit. I love that game so much. MCR. Hi, Dark Blood again. Okay, we're, we're ready to do it. Hey, Eds. Hello, hello. I'm great today. How are you doing? Nice to see you again. Hi, Forticulus. Flirt with an E. Okay, this is better than fighting you. As in, like, spending time with her is better than fighting her, is that what she's saying? I feel like flirting is not going to go down well at this... We, we literally were shouting at each other about 20 minutes ago, so I don't know if this is going to be a smart move, but I'm going to do it. I like this better than fighting with you. Way better. Helping you rather than wanting you dead, you mean? You seem like a woman who gets what she wants. <laughs> These days, yes. These and days? I'd really rather have you on my side. Wise choice. Oh my god. Okay, that one well. I feel like I actually I was surprised. Tell me what I should do. What should I do while you're formulating? I don't like sitting on my hands. Yeah, I've noticed. If you wish to keep busy, burn down the city. Start a revolution. Become a terror the likes of which mortals only dream. Um, <laughs> really? No, Grace. Go home. Be patient. When you see me next, I'll have a better idea of what to do. It's not fun unless you flirt with everyone. <laughs> she did a song for World of Warcraft? Did she? Laura did? Smile like you mean it. Okay, so that was Act 1. So Act 1 is about two and a half hours. 
Okay, we're home now. Is Freddy there? Do I live with Freddy? Hey, Freddy. Have, have you been waiting up this whole time? It is. Uh, we live together, right? Yeah? A goat man sends you off into the night. Your life is on the line. And I'm gonna, what, sleep? Fair. What if you were taken prisoner? Kept in a cave by a cyclops? Or, I don't know, turned into a tree? I was worried sick. I feel, I've, <laughs> I've been flirting too much. I've flirted with everybody. I feel like it's now disingenuous. I have to pick. I have to- I have to pick. Omni-flirt! <laughs> Omni-flirt. I've never heard. Oh my god, we have a flirt counter. Anna has flirted with the NPCs one time. Focus, Anna. No, not the object of your flirtation. <laughs> All flirt, only flirt. Why stop now? No flirt, she angie. I don't- I genuinely think that my childhood best friend should stay my childhood best friend. If I'm gonna get with anyone, it should be a god. That would be more fun. My god, you all just want me to flirt. Only Anna can change my mind to flirt every NPC. I... I'm... You know, I... I... <laughs> I friendzoned her. My gut wants Freddy to be my best friend. I just want Freddy to stay my bestie. And then, if I'm gonna... If I'm gonna get saucy... We should get saucy with a Greek god. Choose wisely. You know? Turned into a tree. A tree? That's random. No! Yeah, a Apollo kept chasing this woman named Daphne and... Ugh, it doesn't matter. Important thing is, you're back. I met Apollo tonight, actually. What? No way! Okay, alright. You, you have to tell me everything that happened. Huh. Persephone runs a club called the Underworld. Yes. That's a little on the nose. <laughs> I wouldn't suggest saying that to her face. No, she's scary. And you ended up staying with her instead of Apollo? I don't know, Grace. She sounds a little volatile. She is. She's not so bad. I'm going to say she's not so bad. Leo, thank you for the follow. Have you read Greek mythology? Whenever someone hooks up with a god, it does not end well. Damn it. Haven't romantic comedies taught you anything? Always fall in love with the friend. Okay, maybe being with a god is a stupid idea. Maybe you've always had a little something something going on but been too scared to do anything. Oh, I mean, that that also definitely happens with friendships too. I don't know, they just, they just give me bestie vibes. Like the way that they interact with each other, the way they talk to each other, it's like, it's familiar and cute and matey and it's not kind of like, it's not like deep and, I don't know, maybe that's just how I... Saucy, thank you for the five dollar donation that I just missed. Saucy, thank you for the donation. The dono no nation was that JFast? Thank you so much, Freddy Supremacy. Really, I'm very sus of Freddy. She's like a god that's been kicked out of the place that they're in. Oh my god, Grumpy has got conspiracy theories. I'm gonna say she's not so bad. She's not so bad. At least with Persephone, you know exactly where you stand. You do, you know exactly what's going on at all times. Wow, she just sounds so different from the myths about her. What are the myths? So what are your options? You need to go back are to Are the myths saying that she's good or bad? I could go back to Apollo's as well. No. Make sure he's not sore about what happened. No, Apollo does my oh, head Oh, and in. Uh, there's this. Pan left a card, says, come by Olympus. <laughs> I doubt he means the mountain in Greece. Mm-hmm. <laughs> What, uh, I just spoke to him. Huh. I just spoke to him at the Underworld. If he wanted something, why didn't he just talk to me there? Because he's creepy and wants to get you alone. Still not a fan? You know how some people just set your teeth on edge? That's Pan. I can't help it. But it doesn't matter. I said I'd help, and that's what I'll do. You can count on me, Grace. Thanks, Freddy. The muse! Oh, the embodiment of inspiration! Can you believe it? <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> I got bitch slapped. First time chat, I got bitch slapped. Why? What happened, Candy? What happened, Candy? <laughs> Literally what? Um, Freddy could be a god in disguise. Do you really think so? Oh, I can talk to Pan, talk to Persephone, or talk to Apollo. <sighs> oh god, I just don't know. 
Should I go to the journal? Is there anyone that's new? Oh yeah, Eros is the god of sex. Just hanging around in the underworld looking like a Turkish wrestler taking a quick break from his BDSM dungeon. <laughs> He was nice enough, if kind of wrapped up in his own problems. Hardly seemed the killer type, but what do I know? I don't think the god of sex killed Calliope, frankly. Um, I don't... Is it too much Persephone to keep going back to Persephone? I feel like I just chose her, I just left her house, and now I'm going right back to it again. That sounds like chat wrote it. Oh God, you gotta talk to six pack. That journal entry is top tier. I, my guy is my guy is saying go back to Persephone, but also I feel like I've I feel like Apollo was super upset, and I feel like I kind of actually want to go to Apollo and see if he's all right. I don't want to talk to Pan particularly. Oh no, what do you think? Do you have thoughts? Where do you, where would you go? Right now. Apollo needs space, go back to Persephone. Call the FBI. <laughs> um, I'd go and check on Apollo. Persephone did just tell you to go home. Yeah, it'd be weird to show up at Persephone's house again, having just been there. And Apollo stormed off. I would go to Apollo, but that's just me. I think we should go to Pan. Really? Mend bridges with Apollo. I think, yeah, my, okay, I'm going to go to Apollo. Not for that reason, but just to see if he's okay. And then if we need, now that we know that Pan, Pan is not too, Pan tells us the truth. Well, maybe, you know what? I don't know what I'm, talking, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm, I'm conspiracy theorying myself. I'm going to Apollo, see if he's all right. And we're not flirting with him, okay? We're not flirting with him again. Oh, he looks sad. Uh, Grace. Hi. Yeah, told you she'd be back. What are you doing here? When you stayed with Persephone, I thought that... Well, I didn't expect to see you again. You were a jerk. You can still help. I'm going to say, can't we be friends? I'm going to friend zone him, but also hopefully that will... Mm, mend the bridge why just because i think persephone can help me we can't still be friends is that what we are grace friends yes you helped me you brought me to persephone i'd say that qualifies i'm not sure i've helped you all i've done is <laughs> dropped you in persephone's lap oh, no. what and that's bad yes well no i can never be objective when it comes to my family they bring out the worst in me. It's why I avoid them whenever possible, and why I should have resisted getting dragged into all this. Right. I'm going to say Calliope still needs you because it's a charisma point. Apollo, everything you sang about still applies, even if you got angry. Let it fuel I you. Know. We all make mistakes. You pick yourself up, and you try again, I feel for like Calliope's I'm, sake. I feel like I'm mothering him, and he's like a Greek god. It feels um, silly. I'll think about it, Grace. I promise. For now, you're in far better hands. Oh, here we go. I'll hold you to that. Don't stay with me. I'm not good I for I you. Won't. I'm no good for you. He's back on that again. Okay, so I'm glad we went there. We have we've built the bridge. Oh, I can do I can talk to all of them. Okay, let's talk to Pan then. I should talk to Persephone or go see what Pan wants. Let's see what Pan wants then, because we can do all three. It's not you, it's me. Imagine friend zoning Troy Baker. He seems like a bit of a man child. You know, he's got a quick temper. He doesn't care. He doesn't take care of himself. He's very troubled and is like, I'd oh say hello, no, Grace. But I'm afraid that look on your face might be catchy. Hi, Pan. I'm back. I just, what is this place? He lives on a tree on a roof. It's a garden, darling. Surely even mortals have. Yeah, but this building, all those people I pass getting up here, are they all idols? Well, at least some of them. This is Olympus? Welcome to Olympus, dear Grace. Right. Our home hidden away in plain sight. Marvelous. Marvelous, isn't it? Yeah, where is Zeus? 
Um, is Olympus hidden? You asked me to come. I'm gonna say is Olympus hidden. I've passed this part of the city a hundred times. I've never seen this building. Was it always here? Or... Our Lady Hecate provides glamours that allow certain things oh, to be... Oh, it's Hecate. I always thought it was Hecate. Seen. Full stop. Such as my glorious horns. Olympus is the same. Those invited, see it. Those who aren't, see exactly what they expect. It's not anywhere as grand as in the old country, but it, it serves its purpose. This isn't grand. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna get straight to the point with him, I think, at this point. Cola Bubs, thank you for the follow. Nice to meet you. Hello, Admore. I'm really good. We are three hours into this game. Um, we're playing it 10 days early. It comes out on the 10th of August. And, um... I'm trying not to romance too many people at the same time because I feel like I'm making mistakes. Day Rise, thank you for four months. Thank you so much. Welcome back again. Enjoy the emotes for another month. Thank you so much for coming back four, four months in a row. Technically depends on what part, part of Greece you're from. Right. Oh my God, the time I went at the same time, Raj. That's funny. Hecate is the goddess of magic and witchcraft. So it's Hecate? I thought it was Hecate. So when I was in first year at drama school, we did the Greeks so like the Greek as in like the actual Greek theater we looked into that in first year and we did a whole Greek show where we were all in like linens and we had masks and I had I had a little wreath I had my little wreath on my head and I played a character called Cassandra I was crazy in the play I was crazy I had a lot of screaming a lot of screaming you're amused to flirt with people to feel good and discover themselves are your thing. Okay, okay, we're justifying it. We're justifying it. Okay, fine, I'll take it. I'll take it. You asked me to meet you here? I did. I did, I did. Though I feared you might decline, considering your rather callous rejection earlier. It's not a rejection in that way. Regardless, just... my pride is intact, as is the favor you owe me, which I now wish to collect. Wait, I owe you something? I'm not breaking rules for you, deal. I'm gonna say I'm not breaking rules for you. Fine. But just so you know, I'm not doing anything that's against the rules. I already have one trial coming. Grace, baby, Bulbala. Have I ever led you astray? Bulbala! Not yet. Bulbala. Here's the thing. A friend has begged for my help, and you're far better suited than I to offer what he requires. I'll give you a key to reach the reliquary where he resides. You help him, and then we're even. If that's not enough incentive, the reliquary is also where you'll find the lovely Hecate. Hecate, okay. A sorceress of her power could aid your quest. Okay. What do you say? Yeah. What kind of favor is she, I'm gonna say? Bubula. He doesn't strike me as a Bubula kind of person. Buba? Bubala? Okay. I've heard Greek professors use Hecate. Hecate? Hecate, Hecate? I'm gonna say, what kind of favor is this? This person I'm to help. What does he want? And why can't you do it? Well, Grace, there are some things you're better equipped to handle than I. This, as I understand it, is a delicate matter of the heart. One that requires a muse's hand. A matter of the heart. What, did you think From I was sending you to rough heart, someone up? Set I... something aflame? Don't be absurd. The man rough has an issue up. with his love life. Oh. Even if you can't help him, I'll treat the effort as worth the favor. We're helping someone with their love life now? I'll consider it. I'll think about it. But no promises. Marvelous. The gentleman you seek is named Asterian. Okay. Lovely fellow, quite harmless. Quite. I'll send a package to your domicile that contains directions and the key you'll need to reach the reliquary. I said no promises. Well, if you decide to go, Grace, you'll still need all those things. Say hello to darling Hecate on my behalf, will you? Will do. Bubula. Hi, Ruby. Hi, Cream Mini Cooper. So now I pick either going back to Persephone or... Okay, let's talk to... I can head to the reliquary or... Well, it's not... I can still do all of them, right? I think the second it's pinned on my map, I can do... I can still go back to it, even if I choose the other one. I think so. 
Let's just see what Persephone has to say. Oh. I hope this is not like an option. Like, whether I can't go back again. Fingers crossed. Persephone! Oh, back already, are you? Shit. It's just as well. <laughs> I've asked around, called in some favors. <laughs> just enough to get an idea of what all the idols are currently up to. She's like, back again? Much as I'm loath to admit it, I'm back to thinking Pan may be our prime suspect after all. Really? Because I just went to see him. Doesn't seem like you can choose both. Well, before it said do this or that, and I could do both. So I'm just, I'm hoping, sarcastic husky, I'm hoping. Welcome to stream, by the way. I'm really good, Ruby. Thanks for asking. Hello, Avery. Hello. I'm good, guys. Thank you for asking. You look very nice to me. I'm going to say um, I went to see him and see what she says. I'd, he didn't seem sus. He didn't seem sus when I spoke to him, but I don't know. Maybe that's just because his voice talks like this, so you kind of think he's a bit sneaky. I actually went to see Pan at Olympus. I guess that wasn't such a great idea. It depends. What did he want this time? He wants me to help he someone with his love life. He asked me to repay the favor I owe him by helping someone at a place called the Reliquary. The Reliquary. Interesting. I wonder what his angle is. Could it be a trap? Why is that interesting? What's so interesting about the Reliquary? It's a magical library of sorts. Who knows why Pan's interested? <laughs> magical library? My do as he asks. Oh, do it? At the very least, Hecate might prove to be of help to you. Okay. If it's written in her bloody book. Her book? You'll see. Okay, so we can do both. Let's do it now. I want to send you to a party, Grace. One Aphrodite is holding. What? She and Eros know Pan perhaps better than anyone. If you go, it'll give you a chance to find out what he's really up to. Why a party? Why a party? Couldn't I just go wherever she lives and ask her? You could, but if you go to this party, she'll be grateful. She holds it from time to time. We and get to go to a party. Calliope to attend. Party, let's go. Calliope never would. You can put two and two together. A grateful Aphrodite might be willing to tell you what Pan is really up to. Okay, that seems like a good trade-off. That seems like a good trade-off. Sarcastic Husky, thank you for the follow. Maybe ask all the questions before moving forward. I feel like some things will just tell me what I already know. Or, I feel like I've already made my mind up about them. I, I almost don't want to be led in too many different directions and go with my gut sometimes. Hello, Broccoli. Actually, welcome to stream. I'm doing really well. Thank you for asking. Hi, Stella. Is there any music gameplay in this game? Yes, absolutely. It's a musical. This is, in fact, actually the world's first branching role-playing musical game ever. So it's actually a musical. So most of the time we are singing and actually between these moments. Big musical numbers sweeping. Airbrusher, thank you for seven months. Enjoy the emotes again. Seven months? We have a baby very soon. Two months time. Why can't you talk to Aphrodite? You know Aphrodite better than I do. Can't you talk to her? She and I don't get along. Oh, her and Aphrodite are not Like how you friends. and Apollo don't get along? Why? Even more intensely than that. I once said some things about her husband. They were true, but unwelcome. <laughs> Suffice it to say, if I showed up at Aphrodite's party, revealing Pan's secrets would be the last thing on her She mind. trash talked her One husband. One wild party with a goddess of love coming up. It's she less of trash a talked her husband. More of a somber affair. You mean like a cocktail party? <laughs> Let me put it this way: <laughs> Apollo will likely operetta. Yeah, that is gotcha. what's happening. Expectations of fun downgraded considerably. I'll let you know what I find. Okay. Do you want to do party first, or do you want to do... Why is it still letting me go back to talk to her? I can just talk to her anytime? She's going to be like, go away! She's going to be like, leave me alone! <laughs> <laughs> Every single time I'm like, it's Monday, hi! It's Tuesday, hi! It's Wednesday, hi again! Aphrodite, please. Apollo is a party pooper. Quack notes. Even though it's uh, Demi Notes, I still feel about it. It's Quack Notes. So... Oh. Okay, guys, tell me. What do you feel like going? Do you want to go party? Or do you want to go to the magical library? I mean, we can do both, it seems. I think, even though it says in the bottom right, you can do either or, I think you can do both. It seems to be that you can do both. Party? Everyone wants to go to a party. Library? Okay, people want to go party. Let's go party then. 
party. Okay, I feel like I should wear something party related. Oh no. I don't even have any of my hats with me. Do I have a party hat? Oh. I used to have my little party hat somewhere. Damn it. Okay, well, just imagine I'm wearing a party hat. Aphrodite party. Bow tie. Oh, I do actually have bow ties in my wardrobe. Okay, Apollo's there. This party is silent. Why? Fancy party? Check. Can someone put the music on? Check. Grace totally not dressed for the occasion? Check. <laughs> Leather uh, jacket. If only I knew what I was supposed to be doing here. Grace? <laughs> You're here. Yeah. I'm invited, aren't I? I'm just surprised you even knew it was happening. Persephone said I should come to this. Whatever this is. Persephone didn't tell you? Uh, why am I not surprised? Is that not weird? Hi, Kanos. Do you, do you find him a sexy boy? I'm sure a lot of people in chat find him a sexy boy. Wear the policeman hat since you're investigating. Oh my god. I feel I feel like it's weird to walk into a party and then he's there and he's like, why are you here? You shouldn't know about this. That feels sus to me, no? You didn't tell me either, I'm gonna say. I came to see you, Apollo, and I don't recall you mentioning it. Persephone said it could help. You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? Um... No deja vu, recollections that aren't your own? No. Don't think so. Should I have? Not right away. For a while, you won't remember anything. We call it the veil. In time, the veil will start to lift, slowly at first, but eventually you'll remember almost everything Calliope did. Sounds kind of cool. I was wondering if we would start getting flashbacks of like her mind and stuff. Is this Calliope's wake? Oh, well, if, if it is a wake, she shouldn't have been like, want to go to a party? You should be like, want to go to a wake? Um, I'm going to say that sounds kind of cool. That doesn't seem so terrible. Am I missing something? Well, remember how old we all are. Mm. There are so many memories. So the veil lifts gradually. Like multiple lifetimes you. of memories. Eventually it's like a flood. It becomes difficult to separate what's you and what's them. Oh shit. And all who came before We're them. gonna end up blending. That sounds awful. Will I become Calliope? You're saying I won't be me. I won't be Grace. <laughs> Will I start calling myself Calliope? Maybe. Eventually, m most of us do, but... Most of us were chosen and prepared. I was not prepared. I was not <laughs> prepared I choose this. at all. I understand. Take some time to let it sink in. If you like, we can talk about it later. What? What does this have to do with the party? And why is the party in silence? Aphrodite hasn't been the same since we came to the New World. Where are the vibes? She has horrific memories of what she endured during the war. PTSD. Passing on her Eidolon is a way to forget for a while. That's what this party is for. Oh. She's gonna die? My god. Moonbeam, hi! Hey, okay. Let me check it now. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. You are not prepared. You are not prepared. Moonbeam, thank you for the note. Thank you. Um, maybe that's why they want to ice her before the memory comes back. Suicide party? Well, that was unexpected. I know. I know. Let's just ask. Why have a party? Why throw a party for it? Doesn't that mean everyone's here to... Watch her die? I suppose so. We're also here to celebrate. We're here to help Aphrodite remember before she forgets again. Yeah, sounds like a real banger. Real this banger. party isn't for us, Grace. It's for her. Gosh, I like, I like the way that all of the gods seem to know, like they've got such a wealth of knowledge about each other from the past and they all, it, it's like, it's like they, want to share it but they don't really in the same way that you would if you just like 
If you met a big group of friends that knew each other for multiple lifetimes, there would be so much to say, but they wouldn't want to share it either because it feels cliquey. So you get to hear like little bits of it whenever, when they start feeling more, more and more comfortable with you. Um, but yeah, I like it. Okay, anyway, I think I'm, I think I'm only allowed to go up to around this point because obviously we're early access and it comes out in 10 days. I think I'm only allowed to show you certain chunks of it. So I'm going to stop here um, and I'll switch over now to FF16. Edward, hello. Hope you're enjoying Stray Gods. I'm actually quite excited for this game. I know, me too. It's been such an interesting beginning. The musical numbers especially have been a highlight for me. I'm getting to choose where the song goes. Cliffhanger. Anna, you were in the Sandman. That's the vibe through the whole thing. Very much. I know, reality. I know, I really love doing that audiobook. I wish, I hope I can do more audiobooks in the future because I had such a good time. Creative Tukin, hello. When this game comes out, I'm probably going to be, I'm going to be so messed up, probably. Wait, why? From like, emotionally, do you mean? It's so good. Very comic book style, I know. There's, there's, there's another game, actually, that reminds me a little bit of this with the, it's almost like a comic slideshow and it's not, I mean, it's kind of, Walking Dead, I suppose, is a similar type vibe. Do you think? Yeah, emotionally. Hey, Frosty. Hello, hello. I would never have seen this game if it wasn't for you, so thank you. Oh, no, I'm glad. I'm glad. Thank you, Humble Games, for the, for sponsoring today. I'm so honored to get to see things ahead of time, and I would never get to do that without you guys, so thank you so much for giving me opportunities like this, because I saw, a tra I saw the trailer for this a while ago, and I thought, oh, my God, like, all of my favorite voice actors in one game, and it's a musical. What? <laughs> I was like, this is so exciting for me. Anna, thank you for the follow. Name high five. High five to you for the, having the same name as me. Chicken Coop, did you give to sub to Moonbeam as well? Moonbeam, you have the emotes now. One of us, one of us. Itchy, thank you for the follow as well. How are you Greek with a Romanian name? It's not a Romanian name, it is a Greek name. Demetriou is Greek Cypriot, Frankie. Welcome in though, welcome in. Okay, shall I, I'm just gonna do the BRB screen and plug the PS5 in because I have to switch them over. Sorry, annoying, but. Final Fantasy 16 is a PS5 exclusive. Um, Disco Elysium. I've heard Disco Elysium is also great. Will you pick this back up on the 10th? Absolutely, we are 100% completing this. Absolutely. Once it's out, out. Um, well, once I've finished FF16, probably. Um, depending on how long that'll take me. I think we're about five streams away from, from, from completing Final Fantasy 16. So once it's done, we'll, we'll come back and see what happens and actually find the answer and find out who got rid of Calliope, or whether she got rid of herself. I don't know, I still think that possibly that could be the case. All right, Whisper, no worries. Nice to meet you. See you soon. See you soon, soon. Okay, give me one second. I'm gonna go get the PS5, plug it in. So give me like just five minutes or so. Um, I'm sure the mods will entertain you with something. <laughs> I'm gonna give you some, I'm gonna give you some good vibes in the meantime, and I'll put my alerts back on. Just for the, uh, just for the duration. Okay, what about give you some music back? Do 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 do. I love the music in this section. I want to find out what happens, but you will have to wait until August the tenth, and it'll be out on Steam, PlayStation, Xbox, and the Switch. All right, good. Thank you so much, guys, for watching this bit. I'm going to switch over to FF16. Is there a link to the game? Yes. Um, it's there's a panel and there's also a, a chat bot just underneath there. I think my mod put it in there. You can click it there to wishlist it ahead of time if you want to. Thank you, thank you. Crate with the whip. <laughs> mods entertain us. No pressure, mods. No pressure at all. Okay, I'll give you vibes. Give me a few minutes just to plug in my PS5, okay? And I will be back with FF16. Maximum 10 minutes. Go get yourself a cup of tea, pee break. Get a hoodie on if you're cold. You know, all those things. <laughs> 